Okay, I've been trying to say hi for a second. <laughs> uh, wow, I have these speakers are really loud. Hang on. But uh, I had to cut power to my computer for a little bit. When I do that, it turns off the phantom power on my interface. Uh, so <laughs> I noticed something. I'm not going to tell you what, but I did notice it. No. There. Do you want to know what I noticed? Or do you want to guess? Uh, my audio has been a little messed up since I switched to the new computer. <sighs> 24, plenty more. Thank you, Icevee. Anonymous Gifter, thanks for gifting five subs. Resident Kohai, thanks for looking out for me. And Neo Zero. I'm watching you. I had to I had to get on a step stool to watch you though. Yeah, I wanna play Chrono Cross. Hey go Tetsu, congratulations. Just a sec, I gotta get water. You know what I mean? Dude, I watched Idle Hands recently because Alice Sawyer was talking about it. I'd always been curious about it for a really embarrassing reason. Anyway, I watched Idle Hands and I still have no fucking idea how bongs work. <laughs> it's like, I don't tell me, don't tell me because to me, life is about mystery in, in part, right? Like that's uh that's one of the driving forces behind boredom is when you, you feel you have nothing to learn, you know, when you're stagnating. So I don't want to know how bongs work, but I was like paying attention and taking notes. Like surely I can figure this out. Yeah, it was one of Jessica Alba's first movies. And look, I don't mean to be too critical, but she is god awful in it. Oh my god. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. Sorry about the cough. Uh, how's it going? I actually forgot what day it was today. But then, uh, ordered a milkshake. I know. That does, yeah. Uh, I ordered a milkshake and it got here in a styrofoam cup and I held it to my mouth and I was like, holy shit, I smell weed like so strongly. And then I realized, oh, it's the cup. Like my, <laughs> the delivery driver was smoking that bad boy out. Whoa, shit. Sorry, guys. I didn't mean to scare you. second i'm i'm tweeting i <laughs> lord okay Maroonie versus Dot. I couldn't hurt Maroonie. I, I think it's mutual, too. What's your dinner? Uh, that place I like with the chicken. Mm. But not the... Potatoes. I don't know if that narrows it down.
How is everybody doing? Yeah, you know the one I'm thinking about. Maybe, I don't know. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have been uh, working on some stream stuff that I don't even want to talk about because I may not do it at all. I'm learning new stuff about OBS, though. So that's something. Hey there, Bridgewater. Hi, Farmsteads. Uh, Digital Basic. Sheriff Ram. Gotetsu. I don't think I said hi. I think I said congratulations or something. So hi. Scrooge McDuck's Money Bin and Rojo Mild. And Sardus and Spirit Cells. And Izvi. And Calamari, of course. And Yomidian. Is that everybody? Resident Kohai. Referee. See? Did you? I didn't. I need to go to the, the dentist very soon. I have like a chipped tooth, which those are like ticking time bombs. Oh, hey, Rachel. Uh, 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 let's just go to bed. <laughs> Hi, Adam. Huh? You thought. You thought. You've been persuaded. All right. Where's the 3DS scene? <clears throat> there it is. So, what was I talking about? Oh, I'm kind of in the much better. Hey, that's cool. Almost one DS tall. You're so funny. You're so funny because I'm actually taller than the DS anyway. See? Hey, Gridra. All right. It's time. Oops. In my head, I was like, I'm going to wait for the end of that song. And then I'll turn the music off. And I expected my computer to just read my mind or something. He revealed, like, you never seen that before. Hey there, tiger. That is one of the best songs in the game. The one I didn't play. I don't know that one. It's been a long time. I want to play that game like badly. Dude, this game is so loud. What is left is a holy husk. Hollow ones cling to faith. Fanged ones honor power. Foolish sages protect a lie. Who cares? Who cares? <clears throat> All right, for anyone who missed it, Almost the entire most recent stream ended up being fighting this one boss. <laughs> no joke. Uh, it's fine now. You missed it, all of it. Yeah, so you missed basically nothing. Do you know this game? Do you know the uh, Boiling Lizard boss? I don't think I have any quests to report, right? Oh yeah, no, you're you're here just in time. Uh, I'll go ahead and sleep until morning, I guess. In the game. All right, did I buy like weapons and shit? I forget. No, I didn't. I I was thinking about it when I I left off. Oh, 
Oh, chocolate. Which is not usually my preference, and I didn't like it, so I made the wrong choice. Uh, t -t -t enter a labyrinth. There's something I need on the third floor of the Golden Lair. If I'm not mistaken, this... Uh, This dungeon actually has a lot you can explore after you uh, beat the boss. What? What's wrong, farmsteads? Oh, yeah, I did do that. <laughs> uh... That's okay, life's that way though, you know? Okay, yeah, that can't possibly be a uh, two-way deal. That sucks. Go, Tetsu. I'm sorry. The last pizza I got was pretty disappointing. It was like a fancy, like, vegetarian kind of thing from Domino's, which in hindsight... Why was I getting, like, a vegetarian pizza from Domino's? What was my thought process there? You know? <laughs> yeah, farmsteads. <laughs> Will they ever make a dungeon that's not a maze? Uh, hang on. Yes, it's called Ikea. Remember that? How Ikea is like just a straight shot. Uh, I think Taunt went off. Uh, whatever. Element Guard's actually more important. Whose who's, uh, blood sugar is too low? Me? Is, is this something I need to... <laughs> is this something I need to, like, change on the stream? Yeah, yeah. So, like, the thing about freaking Domino's... Yeah, you don't, you don't want to get vegetarian pizza from... What? Huh? No, because I like vegetarian food. <laughs> okay, good dodge. Uh, damn, look at that. Uh, like, the Domino's can't make that any good. They can't make it for shit, though. Vegetarian pizza, like, that's... Domino's is, like, fast food, right? So, okay, that's why this was here. Um... 
I needed to stick to something real fast foodie, like, you know, uh, sausage or whatever. Surely this is not blocking anything, but you never know. Nice. Yeah, this game's cool. Duh. Hey, that's nice, actually. I don't... So, I eat gluten. Doesn't bother me. But I had a roommate for a long time who was gluten-free. And uh, it seemed like a real pain in the ass to get anything, basically. These guys are really dangerous. <laughs> uh, Blazing Link, I guess. Uh, let's actually line shield the back. Hey Val, how are you? Nice. Ooh, all right. Now nah, they had they had some other like gluten intolerance. It had nothing to do with celiac, but it wasn't like a a choice that they made or were particularly happy with. Hey, Toshiro, thank you. How are you? Okay, so that is exhausted. Uh, that seems good enough. No, why do you want to trash on it? I ordered a vegetarian pizza from there and it, it sucked. And I don't know what I was doing ordering a pizza like that from Domino's because I think that's their forte. Uh, definitely strike guard. You're sick of making them. Ooh. Yeah, I think so. It, it was some kind of like special pizza, not just a vegetarian. Hey, gotcha. Ah, uh, and it sucked. <laughs> uh, I think that'll work. Uh, I think it was the med veggie. Sucked.
Nice. What do I wish I had ordered? Uh, honestly, stuff that we don't even have in my town. <laughs> so, I, there was never going to be anything like that I wanted. Okay, can I ask you something? Now, you don't have to answer, but I'm, I'm curious. Your Domino's, does it offer contactless carry out? And if so, <laughs> I'm curious. Okay, yeah, ours does, and they just don't honor it. Like, you'll place a contactless carry out order, and it'll go in as that. And then you'll drive up to where you're supposed to wait for it. And they just won't do it. <laughs> don't escape. Oh, my God. Escaping almost never works in this game. But if you don't want to, if you're trying to get experience, it like always works. Oh, shit. It's still warm up here. Ugh. I'm just doing this to reset the, uh... You haven't touched it since. iPads and stuff. What do you mean? It's like a curbside thing is the thing. Like you place the order and then they just uh All right, let's look at the map real quick. Uh what is this? Okay, I see where I need to go. Yeah, yeah, they they offer that, the, and uh, they won't do it. Etriac Odyssey, yeah. <laughs> uh, there's really nothing for the fortress to do. Uh, whatever. It should be good. That thing is dead as shit. Oh my god, it retargeted Beth. That sucks. Yeah, me too, Tiger. Yeah, so they didn't get it to us in time, but they just marked it. Marked it as complete <laughs> so that they didn't get penalized for it, which I don't have a problem with that because <laughs> those like, you know, we have to get your pizza to you in, in a nanosecond or it's free kind of promotions are just designed to... Uh, get the uh, the customers involved in disciplining the workers. Like, that's not my fucking problem and I don't uh, appreciate being put in that position, right? Because it, I wouldn't be as mean a boss as Domino's is, <laughs> so.
You got a call on your day off over that? That's awful. I don't think there's a bind that really works on these things. They're just annoying. Yeah, it straight up encourages bad driving habits. So they stopped doing that for deliveries, I think, for that reason. Like, uh, Domino's specifically was getting a bad reputation for drivers being uh, a little too risky. Yeah. But this is... Uh, All right, we're back. Uh, but this is like carry out, right? It's different. I uh, used to do pizza delivery and the boss was like, now don't drive dangerous, but you have to, you know. Oh, you know what? There we go. It was me for like five seconds. Uh, Boniface, how dare you? Um, so I was a delivery driver myself and the boss was like, now, don't drive like an idiot, but you have to get your pizzas there really fast, <laughs> you know, like, like, uh-huh. Uh, I'm forcing the encounter back here where the FOE can't see me. Wait, uh, head snipe on this one, leg snipe, there we go. I'm zooming. I wasn't. That was actually a really fun job. Like, I like pizza delivery driving, but it's a fucking racket. Oh my god, I had the healer attack, what am I thinking? Yeah, I understand. The problem with pizza delivery driving is like, you make a shitload of money in tips. That's nice, but, uh, oh shit. Um, Here's how I feel about delivery driving, okay? The issue is that it, uh, whoops. It puts a lot of wear and tear on your vehicle. Oh, I can discard like, yeah, four. Oh, I might be, no, we're good. Yeah, exactly. The I've mentioned this before, but I was uh, looking at like a subreddit for pizza delivery drivers, which is a sentence, and uh, everyone there described it as slowly selling your car to Domino's. Yeah, farmers are not an EO4, that's correct.
That came up because somebody was like, oh, I want to try to beat this game with a party of four farmers. And there was like a pause and I was like, that might not be that easy. <laughs> Since they're not in the game and they were like, oh yeah, I must be thinking of three or something. <laughs> Damn, dude, this, this game is really loud on my end. I think on your end it just sounds like any other game I play, but motherfuck. How do you do this part again? <laughs> this way? Ugh. Oh. You have to sneak around. Do you have one picked out? Or do you mean one farmer? Oops. No. Which one? Uh, is four in that collection? You could play four. Four is a really good one to start out with because it's uh, easier. Wow, everybody got paralyzed out of the first three. I have no idea. I think people say three, though. All right, I need at least like three ice stakes. Was it here? Yeah. Am I really out? Did I really run myself out of ice stakes? Oh, fuck me. <laughs> well, I tried. Uh, I don't... Do I not have any thread either? Yeah, I'll be damned. I really messed this up. Uh... Alright, they're on this floor though, the uh the stakes. Hey sneaker nets. Hey, nice. Yeah, uh, so I use that same AC adapter on all of my consoles. Uh, it's the one that Duke uses as well, I think. But uh, to use it with a... Damn, I don't know what's, like, worth hanging on to and what isn't. I guess... Uh... Ice core shards definitely are not worth it. Uh, if you want to use it on a Super Nintendo, you do need like a barrel jack adapter or whatever. So that was a part I had to get off console five. There we go. Okay, yeah, so that's the only console you need it for. I like. In my case, I'm switching systems constantly, so, like, I, like, would rather just have one adapter for everything. Uh, this is really fucked up. Uh, these head snipes, the success of the run depends on them. 
And I'm line healing the front, I guess. Nice. Okay, we're good. Okay, good. Beautiful. Ah, uh, whatever. So I have one specific mining point that I'm looking for, because if you mine in the third floor after the, uh, Yeah. After the uh, large scale has been dealt with. Uh, there we go. There's a chance that you'll get this thing that I think I need for a quest or it might be some uh, equipment. I don't need this many guard souls, honestly. Steel Earth, that's it. Uh, yeah, it is rare. Um, this is an actual 3DS, is part of it. Um, I need to get rid of this shitty old armor. Because, uh, you know, the 3DS is annoying to stream. Hey, thank you, Neo Zero. Uh, so I shouldn't need any more ice steaks now. Of course, I'm almost out of them. I hope Moss Strawberry isn't useful. No, I'm not. Could be something on Twitch's end if if I had frame drops earlier and you're having them now. But there's nothing on my end. Okay, those steel earth items were what I wanted. Uh, I wonder if I can get back to like the main area this way. No, is this another mine? Yeah. Oh my God, please. Did you have to come back in 10 minutes? Yeah, I mean, 3DS ex uh, emulation is generally excellent, but... Uh, it's new, right? Not everything is going to... Oh, I haven't used this power book at all, have I? Uh, use uh, Beth. All right, cool. No, chat being super slow to load is normal. Um, belly skin that seems rather dignified. That's in my uh, six things I can't live without on OK Cupid. Oh, all right. The taunt helps. It's good. You know what? I should uh, full retreat, actually. No, I shouldn't. This floor is fine.
I want to preserve her uh, MP, but... So I will. <laughs> hey, B, thank you. How are you? Look what I'm doing. I'm playing Etrian Odyssey. Uh, yeah, I don't need any of these. Who hit that hydrate? That was a while ago, I think. That was probably while I was, uh... Briefly offline. Alright. So we're set. I just need to get out now. Uh, which I think you can do here, right? Hey, Boogie Yoon. <laughs> no, uh, I think there's something up with the beta that's going on right now. So the online, like, works poorly. I'm not sure it's a complaint with the game. I Maybe I'm misinterpreting what people were saying, but... Boy, am I glad I did Element Guard. Whoa. There. Although people will make up their minds about that game, like, instantly. That's just how fighting games are. Oh, an FOE. It's blue. But I don't want to fight it. <laughs> uh, I should be fine, right? Aha. And a lot of people who initially uh, knee-jerk against the game are going to like it when all's said and done. Now, this is coming from somebody who really doesn't like new Capcom games, but like you can't deny that like that's kind of the cycle uh, with these things. I want to say there's a story event as soon as I go through there, so I don't want to do that yet. I'd rather go back to Tharsis. Oh, wait, I needed the Steel Earth. I don't think I needed that for a quest, right? It was for equipment. Yeah, all right, we're good. Uh, those games uh, predate, like, playable online as part of it. Right, did I need it for the sword, maybe? Yes, probably. That's what I'm saying. That's why I have two snipers. B, the, the way that these games, or the, these characters are designed, all the classes really synergize with one another really well. So having more than one of one class is usually not a good idea. That's certainly, well, it's mostly the case for sniper. But I like the sniper sprite too much that I couldn't pick, so I just have two of them. And it's completely team-defining in the worst way. <laughs> you get it. Uh, select land there. 
finally to the fourth stratum. I believe there are five strata in the uh, the base game, and then there's a fifth post game, but it might just be five, period. Where the fuck am I? All right, there we go. Am I supposed to go back to Tharsis? Okay. I wasn't sure if they were like fine with you going to the geomagnetic magnetic pole in the cloudy stronghold itself, but apparently not. To the Outland Court, or whatever it's called. How Etrian is this Odyssey? Uh, this game doesn't take place in Etria. <laughs> I think that's only the first one. The Japanese title is uh, The Labyrinth of Yggdrasil, or The Labyrinth of the World Tree. So the first game took place in Etria, so they called it Etrian Odyssey, and then all of the sequels are like not in Etria, so... Hey there, Mets. If I recall, Shay was like the last name of some Mets coach is why that's the name of the ship. Whoops. Ah, uh, that's not what I meant to do. Stadium, that's it. Just accidentally taking the Outland uh, count to this really dangerous labyrinth and then <laughs> going out the other door. Did I do it again? No, we're good. Whoa. I've never known how to catch these things. Oh, well. Maybe I do know how to catch, or did know how to catch them, but I don't remember it now. Oh, whoops. Dust Crusher. This thing is a boss. Yeah, it's fine. I was just remarking, not really. Uh, strike guard, I guess. Damn. Binge eating? I wish he had done that before or after the strike guard and not before. Surely I don't have enough accuracy to get away with Squall Volley without first leg binding, right? That would be really stupid to try. Alright, that's fine. Wow. 
Well, that was fun. I really need that uh, dancer ability. Uh, you know the one. Nope. So that I could have uh, let the... Uh, What's-her-name go first? <laughs> the healer. Ah, uh, there we go. Look at that. Alright, it's over. <laughs> uh, oh, you know what, though? Oh, wow, now the bind goes off. I don't know that. <laughs> Hang on. Let's see if that works. Hey, March, how are you? God, party heal, maybe. All right, good, good, good. Well, that was really stupid. Don't do that. <laughs> I'll take you over their count. Just give me a day, a day. Yeah, they are. They are. No. It happened. Oh, I didn't revive Mardal. It's been so long since I've like had a character die and it hasn't been a party wipe, you know? Okay, I'm gonna actually look at the map so I don't do that again. <laughs> I could probably kill that thing incidentally. I just like... Unless I know that I want uh, something that drops, I'm not gonna bother. It might involve restarting for bad luck for one thing. Oh, wow, this is an actual dungeon. All right, whatever. I forgot this song. Not a huge fan of it. Yeah, that's what I meant, yeah. Banger alert, that's what I meant. I always get those two mixed up, Adam. Uh, God, that's more than one space, isn't it? No, it's one. There we go. There's Whirlwind, baby. Fuck yes. Look at this dude. That's right, Loger. Or Logra. <laughs> That's right. Aha. Uh -huh. 
<laughs> they just bought it from the count. Dude, my speakers, I used to have like normal computer speakers, right? Like little creative lab guys. And uh, they, they played out on me. So I replaced them with the only speakers I had on hand, which were studio monitors. <laughs> this music sounds really good on, on those. Oh. Mm. Sorry, I got an I have an itchy elbow. That's cool. <laughs> yeah. All right, I have no idea how tough this boss fight is. I don't remember it. Uh, I know this class can shit out elemental damage. It might actually make sense to element guard. Nice. <laughs> hey, Sarah's Hawk. Thanks uh, for the sub. How are you? Damn, I really wanted to get those legs. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, to do elemental damage, they actually need to go into like a special elemental damage state. So I should have done Strike Guard. Uh, but I can't do that without removing Vanguard. I just have to live with that mistake. Uh, I'll go ahead and Leg Snipe here, actually. Oh my god. Nice. This is still a long shot winning this fight at all, but it could happen. I did though. Yeah, I was trying to think of a joke like that, too. Hey, Maple McKenzie, thank you for the raid. How's it going? I got to this boss, and I forgot how to fight him, so I'm in the, I'm in the process of party wiping. Hey there, Soviet. How are you? Ooh, that was a really low roll. Oh, okay, he goes away. I'll be damned. What were you up to, Maple? Have you seen 4 before? This game is really good. Unfortunately, unlike like every other Etrian Odyssey game, including later ones, it does not have an FM synthesis version of the uh, soundtrack. 
Hey, thank you, Stedious. <laughs> okay, that's good to know. <laughs> I'll recommend you, uh, you can actually beat him here. Uh, yeah, I mean, the the dungeons are, you know, labyrinthine. Right, yeah. Uh, was it? Okay, can someone re refund that? Yeah, they're like little Lufia 2 style logic puzzles or something. Uh, there. Yeah, that usually assumes you're like sufficiently leveled and geared though. Aha! I was hoping this was coming soon. Well, right, but that's assuming they're finalized. <laughs> Early on, when you're exploring the dungeon for the first time, that's not going to happen. that. Alright. What do I need for these? Wouldn't mind another fiery horn, but that's not happening. I'm pretty sure these materials are just somewhere on the, um, somewhere in the next stratum. Like, I'll find them incidentally as I'm doing the combat. Damn, that would be really nice to get. <laughs> a resin cylinder and a tiny tooth, huh? Look at that. Oh, I see. She's way behind. Uh, I feel like this is worth spending the money on. And armor. Damn, where do you get pagoda branches? I feel like I had one. Etrian Odyssey or pagoda branch. What was uh what was going on on the Maple McKenzie ray or stream? What did I miss out on? This game is great. It is that too, but uh Oh, the Minish Cap. Yeah, that could be Gotetsu. I don't know if anyone else is having problems.
Hmm. So I'm definitely way, way behind the curve armor-wise. I, like, I'm loath to spend too much money right now. Knowing that I'm, like, a few fights away from better armor, but you do, yeah. Uh, that's why I have a character named Hi. <laughs> Vanitas and Mardal are two, uh, two of Freya's pseudonyms, by the way, in Norse mythology, if you were not aware. Or you said to get the black flame from the something or other, right? <laughs> I was, I, it's not that I wasn't paying attention, but I, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I was more interested in the story, we'll say. I also kind of want to fight that FOE. So I assume if you're watching Etrian Odyssey 4 on Twitch, you're like already familiar with it to some degree, but if you're not, this game has a uh, a special kind of enemy that you can see on the map, like right now, like this thing. It's called an FOE, which in Japanese stands for Field On Enemy. In the translation, they gave it some ridiculous, like pseudo Latin uh, name. Um, so you're supposed to avoid these things, but I'm pretty strong. I can probably kill this thing now, and I want to try, so I'm going to do it. The last time I ran into one of these by mistake, it did kill me, so we'll see. <laughs> oh. Uh, let's see. Chain circle works. Snipe, why not? Alright, we're good. Nice! Okay. That's a big deal. When you bind a monster's legs, uh, it loses the ability to flee. Or, sorry, to dodge. So I have... It do It also loses the ability to flee, for what that matters. Uh, no, it... FOEs are guaranteed to drop something, though, and it's always like a high, um, what, like a high value component. Uh, so I might be able to use it to build a weapon or something, but it's mostly just because, like, uh, it's a boss. Uh, all right. I'm going to assume Blazing Link. So this ability, Squall Volley, does, like, a lot of hits. Uh, that are really low accuracy. Yeah, I guess you could say that. It was the character design that seemed to most closely resemble my own, <laughs> frankly. Although it made more sense when she was blonde. <laughs> uh, party heal. Okay, yeah, this thing's dead. <laughs> All right, cool. Uh, I found that these things are rarely worth it experience-wise. That's the thing about this party composition. So 
if if you're not familiar with that tree and Odyssey 4 and you like want to know what you just saw. Uh, so this class is the Lonsnecht. Uh, it has a few different things it's good at. But the main gimmick is um, when uh, it's got this thing, this ability, Vanguard, uh, where you guarantee that you go first for five turns. This is like an extremely good ability. Um, and like it has other abilities that are like when it goes before uh, other enemies, uh, you're, it, it uh, has increased um, accuracy and everything. However, the big thing <laughs> is... Uh, it's got these links. So these are like a way to deal elemental damage without like a mage character. The way they work is it does a melee hit that has one of the three elements on it. And then the next thing that hits causes the link to like go off. So it does a second uh, little burst of that element. Improved link increases this to like just a ton of extra attacks every time you use a, a link. So the idea is you use Vanguard, you use Improved Link, and then you hit with one of the links, it doesn't matter which. Then the next like eight attacks uh, that uh, you hit with do an additional pretty decent chunk of elemental damage. And so <laughs> you've got like this, for example, uh, which I have a bunch of unspent uh, Skill points, don't worry about that. Um, I will max this out though. So Squall Volley uh, attacks every unit at random. It's really low accuracy and it does six to 16 hits. Um, so the deal is, <laughs> it's like the damage is not balanced around every single one of them hitting. Uh, they, they are low low accuracy hits for a reason, but this class can also bind the enemy's legs, which means they can't dodge. So then <laughs> the squall volley will always hit and it'll set off the improved link a million times. Uh, and so like you have three turns to set up and then <laughs> you can do this really stupid thing that if it works, it's extremely likely that it'll just uh, like, guarantee the enemy dies. <laughs> uh. In practice, you know, sometimes it works great. <laughs> uh, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, I shouldn't have done that, I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's all right. Oh, that's not happening. Should be good. These are the uh, subclass abilities. There's subclasses like the samurai class, which basically goes into a berserker stance where you take damage and spend uh, TP or MP with every action, but you do a shitload more damage. And there are ways to gain some of that TP back. Don't know what to do with you. Yeah, I'm not sure. I mean, honestly, chat's not very active. It's possible that you're not the only one having issues and no one else is saying it. <laughs> Hard to say. I'm going to go back to Tharsis and then I want to take out another FOE or something.
For one thing, I'm really curious what this gets you. I wonder if that's any good. <laughs> Not really. Five ads per 10 minutes. Yeah, I actually noticed it with a stream I was watching. Maybe given what day it is today, <laughs> a lot of people are at home on the computer. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> I forget, did I kill some of these things? We'll find out. Yeah, I'm with you. Oh dear. <laughs> That's the tank. And it just killed it in one hit. That might have actually been a like an OHK ability. That wasn't too bad. I really, really wish I could bind those legs. Yeah, I think it like got an instant kill proc there. That's bad. That's happening. Hey there, raccoon. How are you? Ah, uh, yeah, whatever. Nice. This might just kill it, honestly. 
Not quite. Hopefully that bind is still active. Yeah, alright, we're good. Not taking any chances, though. Yeah, I'm enjoying my first rodeo. Maybe I will stretch. What do you think of that? I feel like I want that. Even though I just bought her a sword and it's all my money. I'm just gonna get rid of all this like unique equipment shit too. It's taking up space. Are there any field FOEs I haven't killed yet? I actually don't think I did the uh, the second land version of the uh, the Dino Gator. Not you. I obviously killed FOEs up here because they're supposed to be here. Wait, what was that? Oh, yeah, sure. What? What do you mean? Oh, you know what? <laughs> Did you know that staying at the end doesn't uh, fix that? I knew that. What the hell is a stink horn? Yeah, I know about the gold thing. I get the impression I'm going to be healing myself to death this whole fight. Whatever, it'll work. Hey, thank you, Bonesy. Mm -hmm. <coughs> oh, dear. All right, we're good. That's neat. There we go. Well, that was pointless. <laughs> Is the stinkhorn a vegetable or what?
Oh, man, I'm tired, dude. Thank you, Bonesy. Good idea. I have. That's true. I will say, I'm not really geared to fight those things, though. The sheep. That didn't look like it said Stinkhorn. Hang on. Am. You don't have to get it off of this, the like top layer here, right? Because that's for after the black flame, if so. Any layer, okay. I wish I could go up. I don't think I have the thing that helps with that. Hey, Ert, thank you. How are you? Uh, well, I'm not drop, but, uh... Uh, so you would need, like, a steamer basket for that. Yeah, this is the problem is it's just going to kill me with the sleep. Ah, whatever. Nice. That's big. That, uh, that head attack that it does sucks. Fuck yes. Broccoli can smell kind of funny, though, is the thing. Yeah, that's interesting. That's not so bad. Hey, thank you, Sepisai. How are you?
Oh, I meant to save. Well, don't forget to flush the water. <laughs> There's your problem. Can you change the skyship gear here? Yes, how? Oh my god. <laughs> how long have I had that? Oh my god, dude. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, that would be one problem with doing it in a rice cooker, I guess. Alright, hang on. That actually helps here. Oh, I don't want to deal with that anymore. <laughs> I'm never using that thing. Yeah, there we go. Oh, that's probably for a quest. Hang on. Uh, there. Whatever, I can't be bothered. I'm just going to kill it. Unless I'm missing something, this seems to be an especially weak FOE. Oh, not burst. Uh, there. Well, let me figure that out. <laughs> let me learn the hard way. Probably the Lon's Neck is dead. Holy shit, that was really bad. I think it's just that its damage is scaling up or something. My uh, brother had his uh, his alarm set to like just play songs at random, but its randomization was broken, so it always played the very first song. And so, like, God, do you, it's this this Japanese band from like the eighties. <laughs> uh, B apostrophe Z B's. These guys, these guys suck. <laughs> they had like some cool song in the songs in the 80s and like that's it. 
They sound like Aerosmith or something. It's that kind of rock. That's not my thing. And uh, the song was called Arakure. And I every time I hear that song, I just have like uh, this like I get nauseated. <laughs> I hate it so much. Okay. Yeah, no. I think they're like break, breakthrough hit, breakout hit, whatever the term is, was Lady Navigation, if I'm not mistaken. Why'd I do that? I should have done um, Party Heal. Oh, never mind. It's weird, I didn't have any any trouble killing this thing before. Uh that works. We'll see what happens. There we go. Ah, uh, it's over. I might be able to do it. <laughs> oh, I should have done, um, what's it called? I'm going to be real. I thought the sniper was dead. <laughs> uh, what's it called? Squaw Volley would have killed it. I swear to God, there's something in the corner of that map, dude. It doesn't want this. You didn't want that? Nice. Snare circle it. Oh, beautiful.
Okay, I think she has improved link. Yeah, okay, so this might this might do it. Uh, you could do it that way. Fried rice is pretty simple. Leftover how? Like, how did you store it out of curiosity? This isn't like... This might be my own paranoia talking, but... Rice and pasta, they do have, um... They can develop bacteria, um, that you have to be, like, kind of cautious about. So I always... Yeah, yeah. You should, uh, freeze it. How much do you have? Ah! It's over. Maybe this works. There we go. About a cup dried. That's what's left over. So... Fuck yes, look at that. Yeah, yeah. It can survive heat. Uh, which is why, like... So it's like, it's fine when you cook it. It's if you, like, leave it out at room temperature for too long. And even if you refrigerate it, it could develop bacteria that you're not going to be able to kill just by heating it up. So I would, uh... Fuck yes. Um, if it were me, I would freeze it, first of all. Uh, and fried rice works best, like, texture-wise and everything, with, um... Uh... With old rice. So, yeah, I mean, it's not, like imperative but you don't want to leave it out for too terribly long uh but it's pretty simple to do uh i actually explained my my fried rice recipe on stream recently which i'm not like a master chef or anything so it's nothing special but i do make fried rice a lot <laughs> Aha! What class is this chick supposed to be? Working class, of course. <laughs> Good one, Dot. Yeah, I know. Yeah, it'll keep in the freezer for a long time, though. I, uh, I like portion it into individual servings and throw it in the freezer personally. Um, I saved, right? I want to check out that uh, cave. Um, so, you do want to thaw it, since it's frozen? You have a microwave? Oh, interesting.
I think I want to kill this thing. Okay, so to thaw frozen rice. Hey, is that a follow? Thank you. <laughs> I put my own head in the way of the notifications, not really considering. <laughs> but I appreciate it. <laughs> uh, so... You probably want to headbind this thing, honestly. Because I assume it has a poison spit attack. Oh, was that you? <laughs> oh, no, you did want to leg bind it, actually. My mistake. Poison does a lot of damage in this game. <laughs> so this is a really dangerous position to be in. But that's fine. Uh, party heal. Nice. All right, cool. Good, 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 good. All right, do I have improved link? Yeah, I do. <sighs> I don't know what this could be weak to. Spray oil works. So you want to you want to thaw that uh, rice in the microwave. Um. So the way that most people do it is for like one serving of rice, which that thing is totally fucking dead. <laughs> Am I streaming tomorrow? No. I usually don't stream on uh, Fridays, but I have uh, manga work to do. All right, Poison Trihorn. Uh, Um, do it for four minutes at a half power. So on my microwave and like most, that's power level five. But someone, someone was like, "Oh, does your microwave go up to ten or up to five? Uh, last time we were talking about this. And they were like, oh, that would have to be a 2.5 on my microwave, which that's such a weird way to make a microwave. But anyway, like expecting people to enter decimal places with their power levels, like why? Holy fuck. <laughs> All right. Uh, try horn. Hey, objective binary. Uh, I guess I'll... Snare circle? Nice, okay, we're good. Okay, uh... I was just blazing link or whatever. Wait, uh, I should focus on this one. There. And line heal the front. How are you doing, binary? Ha! Badass. <laughs> Snipers are so cool, dude. <laughs> Ah, uh, this is a chop. Oh, I needed those. The branches. Alright, we're good. I forget what that was for. It might have been another bow. Which would be nice. That sucks. I hate this fight. <laughs> it's not, like, super strong. Like... Not a lot is going to be very threatening now, but... There. Nice.
That was close. <laughs> you want to kind of treat this game like Final Fantasy 1, in my opinion, and like... Don't count on the retargeting. All right, it's probably dead. Yeah, we're good. As you can see, if those don't have a head bind applied to them... No, <laughs> Sheriff. When they die, they do that cowering voice thing which is a full party paralyze which is really dangerous I think that's the shape of this room but I don't know oh there's one right here <laughs> I'll be damned all right uh should be good Nice. Actually, I don't think it, I don't think the I'm, improved link is necessary. That should kill it. Dude, I did not mean to do that. I'm so upset. What does Sanctus mean? Thank you, Sheriff. I doubt that. Why did I get a dagger called Latin for holy? <laughs> you know? <laughs> Alright, we're good. Nice. Mardal's the first to the last tier of mastery. There we go. <laughs> uh, that's passive, right? There's a lot 
a lot I need out of this. What about in the Bushi? Surge Mastery? Yeah, I don't know about that. I don't know. It's kind of tough. I feel like I want power boost first. And then I can do snipe mastery after that. Okay, so this is just like a big square room, right? No, not quite. Sick. Whoops. I'm hoping I killed all the FOEs, but there's probably one more in the back here. This MP situation is bad, but never mind this. <laughs> We're good. Tank life. She really got beaten up. Oh, don't outspeed the healer. Woo. Alright, we'll, we'll see how this goes. Alright, we're good. Beautiful. Damn. I would have appreciated MP restoration, but that's fine. Uh, dude, am I? I feel like I explored the whole cave, right? Oh, there we go. Beautiful.
There we go. I needed that for the Walloon sword. Uh, shoot. How does that compare to this thing? Oh, way worse. No, that's not what I wanted it for. There was something else. Oh, damn. Uh, actually, have you not heard the town theme? Or were you talking about the overworld theme? This is kind of appealing. What were the other new items? Yeah, this one's good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The armor, that was it. The Ala Romana. Oh, the poison Haifa I don't have. Oops. Well, that's okay. There's like too many quests. This is like stressing me out. I can really relate to this vessel. <laughs> uh, please don't, <laughs> please don't at people to ask to DM them. Jealous vessel, that was it. <laughs> oh. I kind of forget what training does. I should have actually clicked yes. <laughs> Oh shit, this one's already shiny. All right, whatever. Oh, there we go.
Yeah, these things are worth more experience. I have no idea what to do with my healer this turn. Okay, good. Nice. Did I do improved links? Actually, I think I did. Yep. This thing might die this turn. Unless it does sleep. Yeah, I think I should be good now. Yeah. <laughs> Just one squall volley. Sick. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, I wasn't aware of this. Fireball just pointed it out. Nice. All right. Does it like show it happening? Yeah. I see. Damn. I have more uh, veterans now, or masters. Uh, damn, I don't really remember what all of these are. Honestly, I should probably pump this, but she hasn't really been running out yet. This is supposed to be a really good ability, actually. Star drop. Hmm. Ugh, it's just like... You'd have to subclass Lon's Neck to really make use of this. Oh, no you wouldn't, because I have the, uh, the Dancer subclass. Yeah, that's actually useful, but I don't think she can learn it yet. How do you do Quick Step? Yeah, it doesn't have prerequisites. I'd need to just gain a level. Okay, that's actually pretty interesting. Do you remember how that skill works, Yomidian? Out of curiosity, is it like the, uh, physical or the defense reduction? scales up as the as you level the ability or what yeah 
someone was in here like explaining, oh, you shouldn't level both of these abilities because they're bugged and like one of them cancels the other out. <laughs> I think that may have been Pascal, because Pascal's big into Etrian Odyssey, but I'm not sure. Does anybody here remember how you create uh, golden FOEs in uh, the first land? Just out of curiosity. You guys want to see something funny? <laughs> so this is the very first cave. And I took a quest here that it was like wipe out all the FOEs, which like is not a big deal, except then it spawns this like baboon king. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure like with most parties, you need to be like end game to handle this thing. Nice. I actually did that too soon, though. Because... It may not live, or it may not uh, stay bound long enough for me to really take advantage of this. So it's about to do a really funny trick here. So I think you have to kill the healing rollers. This might actually be doable now that I can survive that attack. Like not this try probably because, all right, there, there is one. Oh, it summons more. All right. Yeah, she has Vanguard. I can just do this. Right on. Boy, I healed the wrong character. Uh, all right, that one's dead. It's alive still? Come on. I can do this, I think, with this party.
Hey, Plombo. No, that's going to kill her. I'll just defend. Yeah, the post game has DPS check bosses. Yeah, this one's done. There's no point in reviving yet. I think party wiping is faster than resetting. I actually want to try this. I just don't know. I got it really low and then of course it healed it all back. But I wonder if there's a way to prepare for that. I think it's resistance to the leg bind might be low. No, I think I lucked out. I think this is a really cool boss design, how, like, it feels a lot more doable <laughs> at first, and then, you know, you figure out what the deal is. It's like an actual surprise that works. It's usually the way RPGs work. You can't, like, surprise someone with that. If they're not geared for a boss, they know, like, instantly. I think Dragon Quest VII is supposed to be like one of the longest ones. Or the longest one, maybe. I want to get Beth and high that that last level. Uh,
The Carpenter's Guild, okay. Where is that? <laughs> mm, give me just a sec. I'm here. The Hollow Queen was kind of boring to me, but I think it might be this team. There's like nothing to it with this team. You just bind her and kill her like instantly. I'm just doing this because this thing is shiny. Oh, I don't need to do that at all. I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, 10 grand for a basically free fight. Fine by me. Who just hit veteran? That was Beth, right? So link mastery is obviously important. Uh, that's good too. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the main thing I need is, like, Iron Wall at this point. I mean, after I get Link Mastery. Oh, I hope I didn't make a mistake. No. Is there anything in here that was like completely guarded by tornadoes? I guess not. Do kangaroos like kind of box in real life? I mean, obviously not with boxing gloves and like with humans and stuff. But are they punchers? Is that the deal? They slap? That's probably what it is. All right. I've never seen jackrabbits fight.
Yeah, they're they got mix-ups. Nice. It'll drown you? What does it do? Drowns you. <laughs> what kind of question is that? Ah, <laughs> uh, whoops. Uh, blazing Link. God, 105 on one Link. That skill's not even maxed yet, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, high just hit 40, right? So the big thing about the dancer subclass is uh, quick step is really useful. Uh... Speed boost, I think, is mutually exclusive with something else. Uh, the problem with the all of these dances is they only work for the front line, and I have a two-person front line. That's the one drawback to this, I guess. Like, I could see not doing uh, the dancer subclass if you only have a two member front line. Um, I definitely want party shield. That's like Kappa. Every skill in a class on one character. I actually forget. Uh, I don't know. Because I don't know what the cap is, even. You know what I mean about Kappa, right? They... They, they drown you. <laughs> the, the Japanese mythological beast. Damn. They they drown you too. It's okay, they're not real. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, that's correct. <laughs> hmm. So everyone's 40. Uh, what's my next step? I mean, I could just progress in the game, I guess. I genuinely don't remember how much of a, like, difficulty spike this is. Oh, this is going to be a, yeah, two-way wall. Very sharp. I forgot I was behind the bottom screen. Ha! <laughs> Not on purpose. 
Oh, yes, it is on purpose. I did that <laughs> for a for a bit. I Conrad to that thing. I really don't want to run into it, but fuck yes, dude. This is how you know this game is so good. There's a new battle theme all of a sudden. Oh shit, I'm like way too low now. There. Get back down there. <laughs> Hell yeah, they are. Oh shit. All right, we're good. Whoops. Oh shit, I might be in danger. Oh my god, this is such a cool monster! I completely forgot about these! With a name like Medusa Tree, I feel like they have some kind of like sorcery attack. So I'm just going to assume it's a good time to headbind. Not that it worked. Oh, that's arms, pretty sure. Uh, arm bind on my front line is very bad. <laughs> Yeah, she has a weak arm bind anyway. I don't think refresh purges binds, right? That's like the difference between binds and status ailments. Yeah. I, this is really not a threatening fight, though. I think this party is probably here to get you hit by the FOEs. That's true, Stevious. I think we did the math. It's more like a third the size. It feels like it's too long. TWO long, I mean. Ah, uh, what did I miss? Maybe there was a door over here. No. They did say something about uh, needing to go to a different 
Uh, maze. This might actually be the wrong cave. That's a, that's what they're called. They're called caves. Uh, whatever. I'll taunt. Nice. Okay, yeah. That really annoying status effect was, in fact, uh, an arm ability. Hey, Pascal, how's it going? Yeah, yeah, how's it, how you doing? What's up? I, I can just hit L here. Oh, you better attack the Medusa tree. Why do I ever do the auto battle thing? Nice. Let me check the rest of the overworld. Okay, the, the Imperial ships just went away for no reason. That's fine. I finally hit 40 on all my guys, Pascal. Pascal, you were the one that remembered, like, which abilities are bugged, right? Like, oh, don't level this and that at the same time because they won't work. The evasion skills. How's it going, Starman? There we go. Uh, let me check the book. Do I still have that one? Wind resistance. Okay, yeah. Okay. This is such a cool looking area.
Hey, Sarzak, how's it going? It's so good. Uh, I'm I am not bad. Ooh. Right, that completely fucks everything up. Luckily everything here is like sorta of weak. So the fact that it completely breaks my party composition really doesn't seem to matter that much. Remember how weak this thing was? And now my tank is dead. <laughs> Yeah, they're both really good. The cat is on fire. Sick. Scorch sap is me after I make a stupid take. And everyone burns me for it online. I don't know, there's an extra. Uh-huh. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, that's Yeah, there's something really confusing about these trees these tree textures. Alright, where did I come from? Yeah, this is the I'm confusing myself here with this map. Dumbass. There we go. Did I do something stupid? Are you asking about the, uh, the scorched sap joke? Yeah, you know, it's just like getting blown up for a, a stupid take. You're getting roasted. I really want to bind those arms. We'll see if that ever happens. Oh, well, yeah. Hey, Sass, thank you for the raid. How's it going? What was going on on the Sass uh, house? What the what fuck did I just say? <laughs> Well, hey, Mewer. Hey, Farmsteads. <laughs> Welcome back. How was, uh, it, was that more high Highlander? You be <laughs> well, was it worth it? Dude, Sass, I uh, decided I was going to revisit the Highlander, like, cable series. I'd forgotten that, like, since it was on cable, that is, like, kind of a <laughs> kind of a raunchy show. Oh, I better turn off the auto battle. All right, we're good. Never mind. Stabs to the crotch. All right. So this will actually take me somewhere new, right? No, no. 
I just never bothered going this way before. Actually, no, yeah, we're good, we're good. It just ends. That was, that's too optimistic, thinking that there was going to be a Highlander, like, Jaguar series. <laughs> Okay, there's another door up here, right? It's like one here, one here. They planned three. <laughs> oh, that's probably the black flame, huh? Maybe not, because it's not black. Uh, why don't I try leg sniping both of them? This could be really good. Nope. Got one of them. That's exactly how Highlander goes. I don't know if you've ever seen uh, Christopher Lambert try to sword fight. <laughs> That's pretty much all he's got. Damn. I'm going to go for it anyway. This is a really stupid idea. It's definitely not worth spending, like, a hundred of the party's TP for it, but it's funny. Aha! This song is so good. Aha. Fuck yes, dude. I gotta play that game. You Did you know, Sass, that I'm like the biggest Highlander fan uh, in the world? <laughs> I, you, you shouldn't admit that, but I, had, I did admit that, so. <laughs> uh, Vanguard. Nice. <laughs> that thing is fucked. That's true. That's on my list, though. I will... I'm going to give it a try. You never know. I might end up really loving Super Mario Sunshine. I can't believe this thing's not vulnerable to fire. It's a tree. Sick. All right, that should be it. Ship was gonna hit so many more times, like up to eight more. This is the fourth stratum, by the way. This is kind of late in the game. Not when you factor in the, uh, the post-game, but, you know, why would you? 
Yeah, that is just an incredible uh, performance, honestly. The Kurgan. I don't get me started on it because it's my favorite damn movie, but... Uh, is there any reason I would want this over the Ala Romana? I don't think so. But the back row can wear it, I see. It's so much money for so little defense, though. I love Clancy Brown. I gotta get a bottle of water, hang on. Dude, Atria and Odyssey is dangerous. I could just play this all freaking night. I didn't hear that. <laughs> I just, I got back and I was like, something's wrong. Everything looks so tall now. Uh, hey, Tara Thiel. Yeah, now I can crawl the dungeons like never before for the next, you know, minute and a half. Um, for being a sunshine hater. Maybe I don't hate it anymore. We don't know. Yeah, it's tedious. It's not just zooming out on the model. Yeah, yeah. Long time no see, Mets. Is Vigloff like a name? <laughs> like a word that means something? What about Kuryonin? Any thoughts on this? What would it mean? Okay, whatever. Ah, Mets. Mets. That's that's what Akuma says. He goes, ah, Mets. <laughs> it's funny to me. <laughs> it's it's gotta be funny to someone. I wonder if that flame thing is like a conditional drop off of the uh The fire guys. Yeah, what I meant on haunting is, is this a word that means something? I just phrased it a little poorly. <laughs> yeah, that... Like, if you just think about that for, like, five seconds, that can't possibly be something that he said in the game. <laughs> like, it doesn't, it doesn't make sense. Whoa, I'm huge now. Well, what do I con to this thing? Uh, no thanks. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, so it's a name is what you're saying. They were probably going for that with um, Vigroff and uh, and FF Tactics. I kind of want to fight this thing, but I know it's going to kill me, so. <laughs> There's nothing interesting on, like, the top level here in the 
ice house. What is this? Sacred Plains or something? Ice house, famous for electric blue. It's... I'm not lying. I'm pretty sure if I fight this thing, I, like, will very much die. Ha! <laughs> oh, well. Oh, it just destroys the ship. Okay, whatever. Oh, that's really expensive, actually. Well, that was fun. Oh, well, I, I deliberately entered the <laughs> dragon's range of attack, if we're going to be honest, but... <laughs> I don't think I ever did that before. I have like no recollection of actually running into those. You do fight dragons later. There we go. Is there anything cool up here? I know. <laughs> I knew where you got it. It's true, too, but... <laughs> there we go. Immortal Peach. Oh, that's interesting. Whoops. All right. Uh, Vanguard. Whoa, what am I doing? Vanguard, please. Strike guard. I've got nothing better to do. It does. Had it. I've had it. Oh, that's too early, but it's fine. I do have some kind of defense lowering ability. Yeah, there we go. What are we looking at? Oh yeah, this thing's dead. <laughs> Had you not seen the like Oh, were you sicking at the peach soda? I thought maybe that was your first time seeing the 
this team's big combo in action. Oh shit, this one's already shiny. Uh... Hey dog, how are you? Yeah, I had no idea about this until Fireball mentioned it. Uh, think about it. <laughs> 3DS isn't that old, or isn't that new anymore. It's discontinued too. Nice. These things have a really annoying head ability. But <laughs> well, you don't have to be old for <laughs> for this to like sort of be justifiable as a retro game <laughs> to me. All right, hell yeah, get owned to me. Yeah, look at that. This thing is fucked. <laughs> it is. It is over. Uh, part of it is the the like design ethos. This is way way more similar to like retro games. Everything is new to you. Well, that's not true either. <laughs> you that's just provably false. <laughs> Let's not get carried away. All right. Whoops. Yeah, owned. Boom. Damn. Would have been nice to get that snare, too. Yeah, all right. We're good. Hey, Terrier Terrier. Thanks for the follow. <laughs> All right. This team is finally like getting okay. The two sniper thing is such a rough, a rough mid game. There is, yeah, you have to target them. Did I? I feel like I took out all of the dudes, right? All the sheep. Oh yeah, it shows the FOEs on the map. There, there we go. Nice. But yeah, if you target the enemy, Happy Toaster, check this out. There's a little icon that corresponds to uh, which binds it has on it. So that's a head bind, uh, which prevents it from using certain skills.
It's over. God, there were still so many Link props to go off. It's too bad that Cursed Wool isn't worth very much money. So I would really... I need to just advance in the game so I can get these bows. Oh, just headbind lower accuracy. That's interesting. This is supposed to be like, uh, blinding. Yeah, the, so the thing about the leg bind with this party specifically is, um, squall volley. Do you know your, uh, your sniper skills? Squall Volley is this thing that it costs a shitload of TP, but it does uh, some ridiculous number of attacks, like 8 to 12 or something. They're really low accuracy, but if you hit with the leg snipe, that doesn't matter. Uh, because they have no evasion at that point, which would be good enough, but of course the Lonsnecht has the... Uh, the link mastery thing where every link you do does more damage than the last one. It scales up really fast. So this is a super gimmicky team. It's not like great, but at this point in the game, <laughs> it's no longer meaningfully weak. It's like really strong for this phase. In the mid game, it's a little rough. And then in the late game, it's really bad is what I've heard, but uh, I haven't tried the post-game stuff since this game was new, which, God, I don't want to think about how long ago that was. <laughs> but it's been a minute. Turn speed, huh? All oh, right, the whole like point of the story. Obviously, I have to know what happens if I ascend. Well, now I know. <laughs> Is there anything cool up here? There's something. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently Twitch is kind of acting up. At the moment, someone mentioned that they had to set their region to Ukraine on their VPN to even see chat at all. That must be for later. I never did the post game uh, when I played this. Fuck yes, I'll explore Golden Deer Keep. Yeah. 
looking around to see if you're in Ukraine, <laughs> you would know. Yeah, I do too. Is this just... Yeah, it is. Yeah, I, I mean, EO4 as a whole is, uh, is probably the easiest of, of this series, right? I hear, like, Untold 1 might be as easy as 4. baby <laughs> I don't know if I have anywhere I can move well it wasn't directly in front of it All right, I'm dead I assume it's a deer they like to make deer really fucked up in this in uh, this game this series I mean That's just realism. I've heard that deer can really fuck you up. In the real world. Damn, this thing is still alive. But it's still bound, too, so I think I win. On a scale, uh, teal. Oh, badass. These are gather points of some kind. Mine. Oh, what was that? Also mine? No, it was take. Oh, of course it wasn't mine. I was getting, like, petals out of it. Alright, cool.
I wonder if there was only one of them. <laughs> one golden deer, and I like... Since my party finally achieved liftoff, I just like killed it instead of... Really playing fair with the game, the dungeon's puzzle. That is scary. <laughs> Uh, what kind of rabbit is this? Suicide hair? Okay, no idea. I assume elemental damage, but I'm going to strike guard anyway. All right, that was a not a very good turn at all. Nice. Alright, that looked like it did a lot of damage, that fire. Sick. I don't think either of these had a bind on them, right? Yeah. That's right. How are you, Sheriff? Yeah, have a good night, Adam. Sick. I killed my healer. Oh, I needed a tiny tooth, actually. I think there was one back here, too, right? Uh, damn, I don't think I have any revive items. I forget what they're called, even. That's a good idea. All right, maybe I can get that, uh... Oh, fuck yeah. I think that was like a really big... Damn. What is that jar component? Oh, the petals? Okay. Wasn't that the like really good sword? Yes, it's the second best sword that I like know exists. Even. I wonder where you get this resin cylinder though. I bet Google knows. <laughs> Resin cylinder. Control F resin. All right, it's deep in the next, uh, the next labyrinth. I'm going to pull the trigger on this. Nope. Ha! There.
That's Is that right? Yeah, that's right. I think there was another door over here, right? Ooh, that's bad. Alright. <laughs> that's kind of scary. I'm gonna guess that uh, Desperation Attack is a head ability. Oh, wait, I think uh, Auto Taunt went off, yeah. Uh, there we go. Holy shit. At least its legs are sealed. Actually, I could probably kill it now. Overkill, but I have no idea how many hit points it has. Okay, good. Tiny teeth are um, really common. I bet that's a uh, suicide hair drop. Something like this, right? Yeah. Oh. Ha! We're good. Yeah, that looks about right. Oh, but no, it must be this, actually. I think that means I'm done in the Golden Deer Keep, right? Shit. Yeah, you're right. Uh, I don't want to lose that tooth. All right, cool. Uh, I'm going to thread out, I guess. No, I need to.
Oh, huh. Uh, damn. That's kind of interesting, but it's so much money for two more attack. Uh, that actually would be delightful, being you. Yeah, that's really what I need, honestly. It's 22 grand, but I could come up with that. All right, a lake northwest of the Scarlet Pillars. Oh. I already killed it. <laughs> Does that matter? <laughs> There we go. Yes. That that actually did occur to me too. We call the Aedicles. That's good. That's funny actually. Oh, it attacked me. Uh, I didn't realize I was that close to it. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> Maybe one of them will be able to run. Did you know they made running really hard in Etrian Odyssey 4? Just thought that was funny. Kinda what? But hello, follow me. There we go. What the fuck is this thing doing? I don't understand how this monster moves. I don't know about that. It's just goggles. Oh, I see what you're saying. I don't know about that. Beth is dead. There we go. No, stupid. I'm over here. There we go. Fuck me. I'm dead. Common core lover. Nice. Thank you, Neo Zero. Here we 
we go. There we go. <laughs> That's true. You can't like do that on command is the big thing. Oh, I'm too close. Gross. Nice. That was kind of a lot of experience for basically nothing. Alright, I needed 22 grand to buy that uh, hammer, right? Or, uh, you know what I mean. There. That's a pretty big upgrade. <laughs> Oh yeah, this is completely unrelated to anything I have to do in here, but yeah, it is, it is. How are you go, Tetsu? Is your is Twitch working any better for you now? Okay, so I need two in this, two in this to get to that. That's fine. I wonder how, well, thank you. I wonder how uh, Star Drop works. Like if the uh, reduced physical defense uh, scales or if I can treat it as a one point wonder. You know what I mean? Hint, hint. <laughs> Does anybody know? <laughs> uh, I could be the ingest server I'm using or whatever. It's definitely not just you. Uh, but it's not on my end, I can tell you that. It could be the server that I am sending my stream to, the ingest server. Twitch is actually a good service, honestly. I never I almost never have issues with uh with it. Windy Archive. I think I did everything I needed to in the Windy Archive, but maybe not. Damn it. Hey, Zenny, how are you? Yeah, I got the arms. 
Come to think of it, I don't think there are any FOEs in this dungeon, are there? I just want to see how much damage that does. Ah, uh, 78. Really not that great, but... Damn, I'm glad I spent time setting up Improved Link. <laughs> hey, that's fine. Are they both leg bound now? No. I swear to God, Blazing Link doesn't work on these things. I'm going to try Electric. Oh my God, it just killed it. Nice. Beautiful. Oh, there was never a wall here. I believe that is accurate, though. All right. Holy shit. Uh, this is an element guard situation for sure. I really need to fix Mardal's binds. The curse of what now? Ha! <laughs> uh, I'm gonna... I really don't want to deal with that thing if I can avoid it. I'm just going to assume that the <laughs> rats outspeed Dot. Nice. All right. Good, 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 good. Oh my god, I just hit space on my keyboard. Apparently I had a Twitter tab open. So it's just like scrolled down my timeline. Whoa. <laughs> it's really funny how we were all like, Whoa, Twitch isn't that bad. And Twitch's threading feature has rendered the replies to that original message completely illegible. It looks like you're replying to her <laughs> when you were replying to Not Rock. Ah, I see. There's a material of some kind up there. There we go. Aha!
Oh, does it? That's good. I heard mixed things. Some... Platform again viewers, though, I think are not totally aware, like, how high my tolerance for, like, NES game uh, jank is. Oh, Sax, I was, you can't say that here. Ha! We're gonna get TOS. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna try this. <laughs> Uh, I don't know, I assume it had <laughs> reduced uh, defense, but it looked like the same. AI based re AI based how? <laughs> I, Portopia getting a remake makes total sense. That is a mega famous game. Not to, you know, nitpick. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. The star drop thing isn't good yet. I've heard it gets good. Yeah, that's stupid. <laughs> Punch up my chat posts. <laughs> really? All right. In that case, Baxter Crook, what's 384 plus 112? <laughs> That's something chat GPT can't do. When you say AI, what do you mean? Like a large language model or what? Uh... That's really cool that it just petrified Mardal and Beth. In the place of a text parser, that's... I can't imagine that working. So this thing is actually really shitty if you don't bind its legs. I'm gonna try this. Okay. Alright, we're good. Uh, I should Sonic Raid here. There we go. Uh, damn, I don't have a way to remove dots petrification. Right, I don't think. That's fine, because I think I have a thread, right? Yeah. Ah, that sucks. Yeah, I don't really like talking about that stuff on stream because people get really worked up about it, to be frank. Like, I have my own opinions on it. Uh, whoops, uh, clinic. There we go. <gasps> no! I forgot.
That might actually be a use case for uh, for that kind of uh, AI, right? Uh, oh my god. What the hell was it with this? This quest? To the bar. <laughs> Speech to text for voice input? Oh, that's stupid. Oh, katanas. They're fluffy. Oh, she's talking about the sentinels. Never mind. <laughs> Two wallaby fists make a katana. It is, yeah. What was the original game like? Uh, it used a cursor in place of a uh, a text parser. I don't understand. Wasn't I supposed to... What was that? Hey, soul. I almost said, hey, dot. So I saw the word dot and I was like, I know dot. How are you? Uh, God, I don't understand what I'm doing wrong for this quest. A member of the Carpenters Guild. So I feel like that's the right gathering spot, but it wasn't the right item from it, maybe. I sure do. Because I talked to everybody, no one was like, oh, that's that thing I needed. Maybe it's something weird, like it doesn't work if you have petrified members of your party. Uh, fuck, what was this one called? Wind Resistance? Etrian Odyssey. Wind. Resistance. Quest. Okay. It is the wrong item. Uh, I don't know if it was one of the first with a cursor, but that is like the, the defining characteristic of Portopia and all its clones uh, is you use a cursor and like icons representing all of the stuff you would type into a test par uh, text parser. Test parser. Uh, oh, actually, um... I need that spot to repop, right?
Well, that gathering spot uh, repopped, so maybe this one will too. Uh, Portopia clone, I don't think there's like a pressing need for anymore because it's not like they make new ones. Ah, shit. Uh, I learned my lesson this time. Definitely need to leg snipe this thing and kill it as soon as possible. But it's not, it's not a visual novel. Visual novels are a different thing. That would be awesome. Yeah, we need that. Nice. Okay, I believe that uh, petrification attack is a leg attack, so we should be good. Steel Barb would be a sick nickname. <laughs> yeah, guess why we're talking about it. I don't think it's written by an AI, apparently. They're talking about uh, using like a an LLM to assist in the like parser. Parser. It's the... When you play, like, Sierra Adventures, you know? It <laughs> teach me for not hitting that scroll wheel. It was a while ago. Uh... Oh, you might be right. Dude. <laughs> I didn't buy a thread either, did I? God damn it, Dot. Alright, whatever. Generating unethical replies. Ah, <laughs> uh, not too bad. Ah. Uh... Yeah, whatever. I have a ton of TPs, so uh, it should be fine. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Does that thing even exist anymore? I'm going to be real. I always got the impression people were using that to generate, like, erotic content. Is that... Am I correct? I forget what it was called. Like, AI Dungeon or something, right? Oh, shit. Uh, does she have Vanguard? Yeah. Blazingly. Like, that wasn't the only thing that people were doing with it, but... Adult content. Yeah, that's how you say it like a normal person. What did I say, erotic? That's the same meaning, it's just not the most common way to put that.
There you go. <laughs> hey, Snacko. Whoa, don't do that. Uh, I'll buy two, actually. Yeah. <laughs> Adult content like Microsoft Excel. <laughs> Adult content like, uh, like reviews of briefcases. <laughs> One of the warnings is that, what do you mean? You drew wrong cave. There we go. <laughs> what a silly way to put that. <laughs> Free tax USA. <laughs> They totally knew what they were doing with that. They knew that was gonna like piss people off. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> what a what a freaking world we live in. <laughs> uh, actually, I think these all have annoying arm abilities. I'm gonna do the arm circle. Nice. This song is so good, dude. That's probably really funny if I got it. <laughs> you know why this music is so good, right? Do you know who the composer is? Yeah, I, <laughs> I'm a little embarrassed to say I got the second meaning that you provided. It was the first that I was like, huh? <laughs> God, it's just not worth it to heal. Uh, here's one big problem with this thing's soundtrack, this game's soundtrack. There's no uh, FM synth version. No, don't escape! God damn it. Okay, good. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> Please give me the uncommon. Dude, this sucks. <laughs> uh, so like the, the Mega Drive sound chip uses FM synthesis. It's frequency modulation. Um, it's just a way to synthesize sounds. Hey, there we go. Uh, I saw the stretch and I was like, yes, good idea. And I took a drink. I wasn't thinking. Mm. So, uh, it's just a certain sound, I guess. Um, the other Etrian Odysseys have FM synthesis soundtracks. Koshiro Yuzo made the, the Kid Icarus soundtrack? No, he didn't. That was, that was Chip Tanaka. Yeah, that's bullshit. They should. It's a good game. Uprising. I'll be damned. I had no idea. Uh, don't run. Nice. Damn. Wow, I killed both of them.
Where's my freaking stylus? Where'd you guys put my stylus? <sighs> Under my keyboard? Why would you do that? How did I lose this? My desk is like completely spotless. Uh, you ever play Streets of Rage, Soul? Those are famous Koshiro Yuzo soundtracks. Oh my god. That's, uh... Don't do that. That's not fair to do to me. Yeah, 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 same. Same guy. No! I'm sorry, Seppisa, I didn't mean to didn't mean to blow you up. Thank you, Neo Zero. Even though I know why you did that. Yeah, he did a ton of games. Adventure Island 4, which sounds like dog shit. I, I hate Adventure Island 4. I I mean no disrespect to the man. He did a great job. Except he didn't, because I, I think that music is freaking punishment to listen to. Adventure Island 4 is such a, like... Or no, Super Adventure Island is what I mean. Adventure Island 4, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, is a different thing. But that is such a, like, bargain basement video game. Revenge of Shinobi is my personal favorite uh, Koshiro Yuzo soundtrack, although honestly, it's pretty damn close. Stop it! Oh my god. Yep. Uh, I only look down at it when I do uh, the mapping and stuff. Because this uh, mod is extremely low latency. Like any non-action game is honestly completely playable just looking at my OBS preview. Uh, so I only look at the DS itself when I'm uh, doing the mapping and I like really need a good look. Uh, Alright, whatever. This thing has a shit ton of defense, huh? Very bad elemental defense, though. I cannot believe it's still alive. What kind of games? It's funny, I, um... So, I have a real problem with uh, running emulators in Windows 10 and Windows 11. Um... Where, like, they just... They're so laggy for me. Uh, no matter what I do. And, in fact, I did what I could to optimize an emulator for, uh... Like, low latency, right? Uh, and uh, could not make the emulator less laggy than my consoles running through my capture card. But I have an unusually responsive capture card, so that's a little, like, deceptive. This is a terrible quest, how it needs the uncommon drop from this, like, 
This is the only instance of this gathering spot, to my knowledge. Uh, it's the Mycomsoft SC512 NL-1 slash DVI or something. I, I probably didn't get the name just right, but pretty close. Dude, I hate this encounter so much. Nice. Oh, we should do that. There's no way this is like any decent damage at all, but you never know. That was okay, actually. Damn, it's still alive, dude. I want to play Mario Kart 8. <laughs> I have it now. Yeah, yeah, let's. Oh, hell yeah. That's a take spot, not a chop. I think that take should probably be called a uh, pick. Fifty CC. I'll do it. I've never played before, so I don't really care what like. Yeah, gather might be what you want. I can't believe how annoying this quest is. <laughs> Why would they do it this way? Why would they make save default to no? But when you pick save, it defaults to yes. Mystifying. That one kind of makes sense, I guess. Do you have like a... Like a go-to um, character you like in that game, Snacko? No. <laughs> 
Why would you assume that? They're all fun. Yes, good. Ha! Uh, I feel like fire is the way to go on this. Fire honestly seems like a really common elemental weakness in this game. Dude, I love Wario. He was who I played in uh, Mario Kart 64. Because I like this silly voice. As far as I can tell, these Peach Crows are like just weak. They're just like piles of HP that don't do anything. It stuns, I guess. Who can guess which character I'm going to play in that game? In Mario Kart 8. Yeah, 64 area Wario was so good. I'm stunned. No one's guessed it yet. Mar not, not Mario. <laughs> yeah, Neo Zero. That's <laughs> its baby Daisy. That's why I was, I reacted the way I did. When, ha when Happy Toaster was like, are you gonna play Baby Peach? Like, no, but basically. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit, I think these are arm. Please tell me that doesn't exist, Cozy. Nice. Why on earth? I think rose gold looks fucked up. I think it shouldn't exist. I love the those that like monster model. It's so good. Baby metal Rosalina. <laughs> yes, yeah, she's uh making metal fans mad the whole world over. Oh, this is another chop spot. Fuck yes. That's not chop. This is chop. Oh my god. I've talked about this before, but you know how like a lot of people hate baby metal? The band? Have you seen uh, that screenshot of like Rob Zombie, I think it was? It's some like respected, you know, music guy. Uh, posing with fuck my life, posing with baby metal. And uh, one of his fans is like, Rob, I'm so disappointed in you. Like, what are you doing posing with these these? It's some, you know, it said something nasty anyway. <laughs> and he just, and he just replied, they were all harder than you, which like, can you imagine if you're that kind of guy 
like how just gutted you'd be that Rob Zombie himself told you off. Nice. Obliterated. Hey, Chupo. <laughs> That's cool, Boneface. Yeah, but it would be the, the May version of the destroyed graphic. You've seen May's version of that, right? It's like balloon letters. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Emily, what does that mean? So it goes, Emily. I've literally seen this whole dungeon, I think. Oh, I see. Oh, why didn't I pick that up? Whatever. Hell, they ought to call them Teenage Metal now. They've been at it so long. Pre-teen metal? But <laughs> that's somehow... <laughs> I don't think that works. <laughs> Tweeny Metal? Yeah, there you go. Dude, I can't believe this quest. Senile metal. You skipped some phases there, I think. YA metal. Saint Anchor, god damn it. Oh, didn't Metallica just release a new album? I heard about this. Do you think they know how much I hate him? <laughs> Metallica! <laughs> oh my god. I used to think it'd be really funny if those guys were like furries. But like of the constantly like flirting and and like ERPing variety. I I would like to imagine in my in my my eyes are killing me, dude. They hurt so bad. Cause it knows that I'm talking that I'm talking about this. My eyes do, I mean. Like, I'd like to imagine that like Who are the two that really don't get along? It's like Jason Newstead and uh and uh Lars Ulrich, right? And uh Oh my god, my eyes. I think they were the two that had a feud. Uh, cause Jason Newstead's not in the band anymore, is he? Uh, and, uh, I'd like to imagine that, that they were like, role playing with each other with like skunk personas and neither, they, they had no idea it was each other. It's just a, just a. 
fun scenario, I'd like to imagine, for really... For normal reasons, I guess. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they, they treated Jason like shit. They also don't remember doing it, apparently. I never really thought of Metallica as like a super like druggy band, but apparently they have legitimate like memory gaps. You ever heard this story about, you know how um, and Justice for All sounds like trash, right? Oh my God. <laughs> it's a very good sign it's not normal. Well, what gave you that idea? <laughs> uh, I think Element Guard is necessary here. Um, I, does anyone have any idea what I was talking about? Oh yeah, Jason Newstead. So what I've heard is like, if you didn't know, if you've never been through a Metallica phase, first of all, uh, what's that like? I kind of envy you. Second, uh, and Justice for All should be a pretty decent album. Uh, I might go so far as to say good, but it sounds awful you can't hear the bass at all it's just like an extremely poorly mastered uh album and uh and it's notorious for it to the extent that like when they got when metallica got inducted into the rock and roll hall of fame or whatever the guy who produced that album was there because he's like a really famous dude and they approached him and they were like what the fuck was up with the mixing on Injustice for All. And he's like, what? Honestly, I think a bad religion for, uh, phase is cooler. <laughs> he was like, what, you guys don't remember? You told me to do that. I had no idea what was wrong with you. And they had no memory of this, but they did it because of Jason Newstead. So remind me there, was it Cliff Burton? Their really famous and really beloved bassist had just passed away tragically uh, and they had a new basis that they weren't getting along with when they were recording Injustice for All and so to fuck with him they had it was Cliffy B yeah that's it um, they had um, they had the guy mixing the album just cut the bass out so you couldn't hear the new guy at all Yeah, I I feel for them too. Fuck yes. Oh, I got two of those. <gasps> Would you look at that? Finally, dude. That took so unbelievably long. This had better be like just so much. <laughs> God damn it, Etrian Odyssey. Maintained his unique relationship to Tempo. Oh, that's funny. Hey, FM Synth, thanks for the raid. Sorry, I'm playing the one game in this series that doesn't have an FM synth soundtrack. Ha! How are you? Hey, thanks for the follow. Hey, Corgi. Hey, thanks for the follow. 
Oh my god. But anyway, yeah, that's the story with Injustice for All. They were like getting passive aggressive with Jason Newstead over it. DK94. Yeah, I've like started that game a few times. Fuck, they... That... Hang on. How do I get to my book? There we go. It is for the sacred... Or no, not for the third stratum, right? Yeah, Scarlet Pillars. Okay, that's the second stratum. James's open contempt for Lars. I, yeah, like on the... Hey, Vox, thanks for the raid. How are you? <laughs> We're talking about Metallica. <laughs> How's it going, everybody? I'm playing Etrian Odyssey 4. What was what was going on on the Vox stream? Hey, thanks for the shout-out mods. Uh, ooh, I should take that out. Ah! Yeah, I have to kill this thing. I hope I can do it. It's weak, but... Oh, hell yeah. That's the uh, current, like, four job fiesta thing, right? Uh, fuck, you probably want to strike guard here rather than taunt, right? Uh, t -t -t I'm just going to go straight for the leg binds. This game kicks ass, guys, if you've never seen it before. This whole series is like wizardry uh, ripoffs. Um, okay, good. Nice. Okay, this thing's probably dead. Um, so I'm fighting like a special kind of enemy, actually. Uh, the, uh, yeah, it's taking so much damage. I don't need to do improved blink. Um, there are like random encounters in this game, but there are also encounters you can see on the map. Uh, those are called FOEs, which in the Japanese version stands for field on enemy, like an enemy on the field, but they like came up with some ridiculous uh, retroactive acronym, or they call it as they call that a, a backronym for it. It's some kind of like long ass uh, Latin thing. That's what that thing was. So even though I'm really over leveled for it, it's like really dangerous. Uh, and I only went after it because it was a shiny, so it was like quintuple experience or something. No, not the dungeon. Field on encounter, that's right, it, that's right, it's encounter. Ah. No, not what I not what I was looking for. I don't suppose anyone's played EO4 and remembers this quest, huh? The missing person quest? Is it down here maybe? Yes, played don't remember, yeah. That makes two of us. There's like a... A person went missing here. And I'm supposed to like find him and mark his location on the map, but... Uh... No, I mean, if you want to do food here, be that getting it or making it. Uh, I'm actually open to that idea, but if you'd rather not, yeah, just go ahead and make your macaroni and cheese. The song's the only thing you know. Uh, fuck. What was this quest called? Etrian 
Odyssey 4 missing person or something. I love this game, DJ. I'm actually almost done. Uh, well, I'm I'm going into the final stratum of the labyrinth. I might mess with the post game a little bit as well, but. Okay, you have to go into the noisy marsh. No, don't stop watching. No. Well, you 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 can do whatever. I'm not Not your not your freaking boss, but you don't have to stop watching. Uh, I'm actually not going to do like late game stuff anyway. Oh, hell yeah, I'll hydrate. So, Limo Police, I'm playing a really, like, suboptimal party. It's a Lon's Neck, a Fortress, two Snipers, and this is the problem. No! Damn it. Uh, classes aren't really designed to be, like, self-synergetic in this. Like, you, it's rare that you want more than one of the same class. Um, yeah, I started either Nexus or Five. I don't remember, but I wasn't enjoying it. Oh, whoops. Duh. <laughs> uh, it's probably not necessary to like pull out all the stops. I assume I'm like crazy over leveled for this, but you never know. Alright, cool. I think I win. Okay, Vox, what did you say? Uh, whether you're coming over. Uh, if you want to come over, Vox, uh, you could bring a mic, or at least I have a match to microphone, but I don't have a dynamite or a uh, <laughs> to a robot. You might be waiting for a while. I don't have a another dynamite or I think an XLR cable. Um, it's just a thought. All right, that's a shitload of TP wasted on this, but these weaker FOEs can still surprise you. It's up to you. I mean, if you'd rather not, that's fine, too. Yeah, yeah, okay. Whoops. Oh, my God. What what has happened to me? No, don't do that. What are you doing? I think I wanted to do this, although I'm not actually sure that the floor looks like that. Whoops. Yeah, the I think the Hollow Queen is in the game to teach you to use binds, honestly. Because you get the guest Arcanist right before uh, the Hollow Queen. Uh, damn. Okay, I don't think the Squall Volley is necessary, but I do want to do Leg Binds. I can't believe it didn't work. All right, now this thing's weak. Ah, <laughs> uh, whatever. That's a good emote. That was a huge crit. So anyway, this is kind of a weak class, or weak party, just because I have two snipers. Sniper is fine. Hey, Chris, thank you. How are you? 
Sniper is fine. There's nothing wrong with it, but there's something wrong with two. <laughs> and the reason I did it is I think these have really cool looking... Um, I think the uh, snipers have really cool looking uh, portraits. But I couldn't decide which one I liked more, so I just put them both in there. Uh, I'm all right. Did you stream today, Chris? Oh my God, that's not what I thought it was. It's really the only valid reason for two snipers. I mean, they're okay. As classes, as Etrian Odyssey 4 classes go, they are probably among the most, like, self-synergetic, honestly. Okay. Okay, so we're looking at something like that here. Uh, the thing I love about this game, well, it's really everything, but I really like that uh, it doesn't have, auto, or rather that you can play without auto mapping, you know what I mean? They add an auto map to the later Etrian Odyssey games. I don't think they're like lesser games for it. Uh, but I do appreciate that you're not, or you have the option of doing it manually. Oh my God, dude. It's also why if you can tell, you can probably tell from my live 2D model, I'm looking down right now. <laughs> oh, you saw the D&D movie? I feel like I've mostly heard positive stuff about that. It's a large bill, yeah. Dude, I got I got rabies or something. Did anyone ever figure out which movie I'm thinking of with that. The I Got Rabies thing. Yo, surprise attack. I like the medic portrait a lot, yeah. That's why I named my medic Dot. <laughs> uh, Bright Guard, I guess. Yeah, thanks, Soul. See you. Uh, yeah, this will die in this turn. Yeah, I love a straight, a straight up fantasy movie. You like those Conan movies? I like those. Dude, there's so many freaking frogs. I'm gonna run out of TP. What is this, the beginning of the pandemic? Hey. The joke is that TP can stand for toilet paper. I'm not explaining what toilet paper is to you. That's dirty and gross. <laughs> I want to take that frog out. Aha! Go 
God, I'm glad that this is fun now. This party took a really long time to get off the ground. Uh, yes, Asterite. Hey, Altriok, how's it going? Uh, I spent some time in Japan, actually, and, uh... I feel like I remember 24 being pretty popular in Japan. Uh, when I was there. 24 might have been done by then. I don't really remember. That show ran forever. And there was a little bit of, like, lag between that, um... That show, you know, being big in America and being big in Japan. Alright, I'm... Just running Vanitas out of TP, I guess. Yeah, there's a big, uh, what, viewership audience for American TV in Japan. Uh, American movies, too, of course. I think it looked something like that. Where's the soldier? They are, yeah. Well, I mean, that that's one way to look at it. Um, anime is just a word that means cartoons, right? So. Uh, fuck. I feel like glutton binds you want to um, head bind. Nah. I'm just going to do it after I find the, um, the soldier anyway. Yeah, that is a, that is a good clip. Better call to Salto, Breaking Bad, no, Bangosh Des, Yoroshku. Is this what this looks like? Yes, it must be. Bob Odenkirk Des. I like genuinely feel bad for celebrities who it's clear that like they they were like, all right, recorded this promo for the show. Here, we wrote we wrote Japanese out phonetically. <laughs> it's just like, what the fuck am I supposed to say? Have a good night, Gotetsu. You know what? I want to play the 3DS SMTs. Oh my god. I don't have... Oh, I see. Uh, I don't know. Large build bone. I don't need any of this crap. I cannot believe they told Steven Spielberg to say Konnichiwa. That is, that is so mean. I guess he'll have to, he'll have to salve the wound with the knowledge that he's a beloved public figure who changed cinema forever. <laughs> you can't hold anymore. Fuck. Uh, there's no, there's no way I need this shit, so it's fine. It looks pretty complete. I gotta hit that one square. <laughs> How does he pronounce Itsumo? Does he say Itsumo? Like Itsumo, something new.
Uh, I might actually need that ebony fur. Uh, I can't see this. Okay, it's green. Fuck. I love this uh, boar model so much. It's one of like the best models I've ever seen in a video game. It's the most something new. God, why did you plant that in my my brain? I'm going to be thinking about this. been here, Emily. You can't pull that. Oh. God, I really want to fight that thing because it's shiny, but it could kill me. I'm essentially out of TP. I'll just do this. Aha. Hi, <laughs> Emily. Great job. Uh, no. Hey, thanks for the follow. That was so much money. All right, how many of these aquails can I make? Just one, right? I probably can't afford it. I can. I feel like I have to do this. Guys, he's so mean. <laughs> it, yeah, she is. Smart hammer. Fuck yes, dude. Dot's almost level 44, baby. That's what I'm saying, Athon. Ithon? How do I say your name? I like how staying at the inn for two hours restored all of my shit. You know? Uh, I really need to try to get another one of those things so I can build that second bow. Uh, I saved, right? Yeah, yeah, I saved. Just a little too long on the last note. That sounds awesome. Yeah. Yes. What are you thinking of EO2 so far? Oh yeah, I have to like actually try. These things are actually dangerous now. Uh, arm snipe. Nice. That was the less likely bind. 
So, of course, that one didn't work. Oh, <gasps> sick. Uh, all right, freezing link. Uh, I think they're permanent. It's so like once you get a hammer, you can uh, use it to upgrade weapons in that way. I just never bothered with it. It doesn't feel like a mechanic that's necessary in the uh, um, the base game because you're constantly replacing weapons. It's so good. All right, I really need that branch. Give me that branch. It was like the Polonia branch, wasn't it? No, it was some kind of shit with like a J in the name. Yeah, yeah, I... I that's how I interpreted that. All right. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, God, I'll do the arm circle, I guess. Nice. That was really important. This thing has... Uh, so these... Binds, what they do is they reduce some stats and they also uh, disable certain uh, certain abilities, sort of like a targeted silence. This thing has a really nasty arm technique that uh, will apply an arm bind to the the whole front row. So these, these fights where they're in the back row, like they can kind of go either way. You either bind their arms before they get to move and they're like super easy, or you don't do that. <laughs> and you hate it. Damn, these guys are in bad shape. Uh, yeah, this one. Yeah, the rats, the rat model is so good. That's like a really, that's a model you run into really early. I kind of feel like the, there are more charming early models. Like the rat, the boar, the shoe bill, or large bill. Uh, nice. This scorpion is probably the hardest enemy in this uh, dungeon, honestly. Yeah, the mushrooms are really good because they do the little dance. Yeah, yeah, you're onto something. Okay. Uh, what are we looking at HP wise? I think that's unnecessary. Whoa. I made this joke earlier when there weren't as many people watching, so I'll make it again. Steel Barb would be a really good nickname if your name was Barbara. Then again, maybe that's why there weren't many people watching. Yeah, forget I said that. There we go.
Uh, there were like three raids. Uh, FM synth raided too. Looks like you brung me a hammer. Whoa, don't do that. I gotta sell that. There we go. She's supposed to talk funny, so that might be what's going on there. I don't know. Hey, I found you. Ah, uh, head hammer, huh? The cramped nest. Do I have the snow garden? Oh, I should try this again. Okay, so there's this uh, cool quest. The very first cave you're in has an FOE that's like a baboon. And uh, they're dangerous when you're level one, but they're pretty weak after that. So you get a quest kind of early in the game that's like, hey, go back to the first cave and kill all the baboons. And when you do, a big boss baboon pops out that I like absolutely cannot take. So <laughs> I'm gonna try it again. I remember doing it like basically at the end of the game last time, but maybe I can do it earlier. I'm here. Baboon, yeah. Oh man, I love this game so much, dude. Here we go. Wings slumbering in the forest. It's so good. I need more for the fortress to do.
This is an EO3 song? No shit. Ah, uh, she's not going to outspeed anyone. Damn. I just want the bind to work. Is that too much to ask? Ah, this is bad. This is going to time out really poorly with its gimmick. Uh, yeah. I'm just going to waste the TP if she outspeeds it. Yeah, this is the turn where it sucks, so. Oh, am I going to get it? Nice. Okay, one's down. Uh, shit. I need to re-up Vanguard. There. Damn. You know what taunt wore off, didn't it? Yeah. Nice. Oh my god. Oh shit, this could be it. <laughs> okay, so Blazing Link. Quick step. Squall volley, squall volley. Wait, uh. Burst. Blazing link. Burst. Quick step. Squall volley. Squall volley. Uh, and. Star drop there. I'm going to win, I think. <laughs> yep, fuck yes, dude. <laughs> you have to trust me, that's a really hard boss. Oh, that was like perfect timing. Thank you, Neo Zero. Mm. like no experience for as ridiculously hard as that fight is. I'm pretty sure at least one of the uh, the Squall Volleys did over a thousand damage before uh, the Lynx <laughs> I don't know which song you're talking about, but I know you're correct, so. Ha! 
<laughs> That's actually really cool. That you can get this thing that causes panic like all the time but does no damage. The star drop only did one damage. It lowers the defense, yeah, of the uh, the target. And I have quick step on the uh, tank, which is a support ability that allows you to pick a character to go first. So I put that on the mimic. So when she did, or on the mimic, the medic. So when she did uh, star drop, it went first, and then everything did physical damage. Yes. Oh my god, you get a burst slot for that, too. I knew nothing bad could befall the Mets Guild. The Mimic Medic. Yeah, that was a shitload of experience. Hell yeah. Speaking of which, I haven't looked at my burst skills in a while. They're probably like... I like full retreat, personally. Uh... <gasps> I should use that. <laughs> you know what I mean? High chance of binding all parts of one enemy. I should actually do this. I should put this over analyze. Fuck yes, dude. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Goodbye. So let's see, I'm good on bows. What's my, I think I'm low on burst. Yeah, cause I did the, uh, I use them on the boss. Uh, shit, man. Go back to quests. Ah, uh, if they die, if they are killed. So it is said. Okay, I think I remember where that is. Yeah, me too. That would be cool. Because all the sprites are so good in this game anyway. Oh yeah, I marked it, didn't I, on the map. Look at me thinking ahead. Nice. Back to the bar. Hmm. 
Oh, I conned blue to those uh, big owls now. I should kill one. Is it true? <laughs> Hey, Snow Crash. A uh, Hamao is some kind of, uh, some kind of consumable, isn't it? Okay, Snow Crash, look away real quick. <laughs> uh, but to peel, okay. Gotcha. You know how I remembered what day it was today? Because I was uh, working pretty hard. I wasn't on the internet where everyone was like, I'm really stoned. And then I would have been like, oh, right. <laughs> I know what day it is now. Uh, I ordered a milkshake. And when it got here, <laughs> it came in a, a styrofoam cup. And uh, it was completely like, it, it reeked. I was saying this earlier. I really shouldn't admit to this. This is extremely uncool, but I just, I still don't know how a bong works entirely. <laughs> I know they make a silly noise like bubbles. <laughs> so I assume water is involved. Uh, this thing is going to kill the fuck out of me, by the way, uh, as it turns out. Raging Raptor! Okay. Uh. But, uh, I do know what weed smells like, which was another really, like, Dot is incredibly uncool and sheltered story. So I got a job in an arcade, and on my first night, I was like, dude, why do, like, all of our customers smell really bad in like the exact same way was there like a skunk <laughs> no dot hey that one's a classic you can't criticize me for that I won How's my burst gauge looking? I'm fighting just to build it to four. I think it was four, right? Oh, holy gift is three, huh? Yeah, all right, cool. They do smell similar, like it's not completely out of stop it pascal it's not completely like out of left field i like how like the world's about to end i just like him staying at the end and like running around in dungeons that have nothing to do with this and everyone's like cool with that. You like the noise it makes? You know what that's from, right? You're allergic to it? Yeah. Uh, it kind of takes me back. It kind of reminds me of the arcade days. 
like the taste of Dr. Pepper. That's a really... I tell all these, like, just rambling life story kind of stories, but this is another one of them. I, uh, I worked at an arcade. It was a very fun job. I, I loved everyone I worked with. Uh, and where am I going? The pillars, that's right. Uh, I did have to do that. Yeah, that was really sad when that happened, but they got over it. Well, they didn't. Um, so. There we go. There's another one down here or something. Oh, I'll be damned. They don't actually spawn in consistent locations. So. Uh, great job. Uh, but... Everyone there was into Coke, not Pepsi. Uh, but they had, like, a Pepsi exclusivity contract, so, oh well. Uh... And, uh... But we did have Dr. Pepper, so we all just would drink Dr. Pepper instead, because it was, like the closest thing to Coke that they had there. Uh, so it, that just became the soda that we would drink at the arcade. Uh, and because of that, I, I used to like hate Dr. Pepper and now it just reminds me of a very nice time in my life. And sometimes when I'm feeling uh, what, what's the word I'm looking for? You know, sentimental. I'm like, fuck it. I'm going to get Dr. Pepper. Transport my taste buds back to ha, the arcade days. All right, let's see how much this uh, burst skill actually helps with this. Uh, that was another 12 grand. I think that's worth it. I have so many skill points to spend now, and, like, I don't have to worry about... Bruce Slotchies is an MP potion. All right, so we have an issue here. All right. Yeah, I don't know. The snipers are kind of fucked up right now. Uh, it might make sense to re to respec. All right, master that. Uh, iron wall would be good for sure. Uh, I could see that, yeah. So as far as I know, the main thing to get out of the rune master is TP boost, free energy, and uh, runic flare. I think these runes are good too, though. Maybe I should just max these out. Yeah, I'll do that. It's an extra, s I don't know, it's an extra setup phase. It lasts for three turns if I had to guess. I don't know about this. Yeah, well, bad news about that. I kind of already got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god. Sepisai. That's, that's what life's all about. Those kinds of memories. All right, is this the uh, thing, the deal? Yeah, all right, we got a stink horn. Was that more than one? Uh, we'll find out. Rip what? What happened?
Uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> I mean, if it's what you got, it's what you got. There we go. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's fine because if I'm gonna do the um, post game, I'm gonna respec anyway. Uh, this head snipe feels like a wasted turn, but I know it sucks a lot when it does put everyone to sleep. <laughs> That's pretty dark. I don't think I need improved link. Uh, oh, it wasn't another twelve grand, it was another uh, sixteen grand. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Whenever that happens. Sorry, I never mapped out all of the uh, wilderness. Now that I have the uh, like final ascent, I feel like doing it. Oh, I know what this is. I think, yeah. We won't get into what that is. You guys want to feel really bad for Voxandra? Do you know the song Mask by Dream? Voxandra does, because I sing it all the time. When we go out, you know, if we need to leave the car for some reason, we will uh, put on an, an N95 mask, and then I'll... <laughs> I was going to do it for you, but Pascal told me to stop, so. <laughs> but anyway, that is what the point of the mask is. <laughs> so you can just stay safe and healthy. Well, yeah, it sucks. You, did, you wouldn't hear it because people tend to listen to music that's good. Bold claim, but I stand by it. Where'd Emily go? <laughs> uh. Ah! 
<laughs> there you are. <laughs> oh, fuck yes, I'll take this on. Bring it. The new metallic. Oh, how, do you like it? Well, I'm genuinely curious, like, what new Metallica is like. Oh, uh, shit. I guess I'm letting this go to waste if I don't use it. Alright, it's dead. What's the point of this little area? Oh, the Albino Taurus, okay. Have they, like, changed a lot musically? Like, is it still the same basic kind of stuff they were doing before? I keep doing that. <laughs> there must be a way up here, right? I mean, I know, I think, what it is, but... I'm telling you, man. This is the thing about video games. Is, uh... Fuck happened there? Where am I? Okay. Really far from it. Yeah, I don't know that that whole load reload sound. I don't I don't get it. <laughs> I say that and that's actually what got me into Metallica was until it sleeps. God damn. People change, huh? Uh no. Yeah. All right, so I explored the entire windy plains. I honestly forget where there I did the scarlet pillars. But I must have because I was farming uh, sheep. One of the guys really hated that. <laughs> yeah, okay, I explored this whole thing. Wait, was that a shiny? I imagine this. I did. Hey, CS Kali, thank you for the raid. How are you? My, uh, my silly team has kind of, has finally, like, achieved liftoff. <laughs> I've been, like, barely scraping by for, like, the entire early and mid game. What were you up to, CS Kali? There we go. All right. Oh, really? How are you liking that?
I've never played that game. I like the character Tron Bon a lot, which is probably not especially surprising. Oh, nice, I have that burst slot. All right, cool. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, God, there's really not much point in taunting. She doesn't have anything else to do. Ha! All right, uh... Anyway, I don't know if you guys know Etrian Odyssey, like, super well. But if you do, you probably notice that I have two snipers in my party, which is really weird and not optimal. Uh, it's fine, though. It's fun. <laughs> which is basically as good as, you know, being good. Nice. All right, cool. We're good. I know you know it, Curry. Nice. You get so much experience doing this. This is absurd. Where was that other one? You there. I did not mean to do that. Well, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> wow, that was a lot of food. <laughs> All right, what's my armor situation? This is definitely the weak link. I should buy that. And I oop. What's up? Hmm. If I could find Red Jasper. I think I need to actually start exploring the uh the labyrinth. I don't get it. I don't get it. like no point in selling that but whatever oh my god dude it's one in the morning i just can't stop playing entry and odyssey so the question is do i go to bed no i go into the labyrinth obviously i go into the labyrinth you wouldn't just go to bed Yeah, but I can't, I can't do that and stream it, so. <laughs> that's normally an option you have, that's true. Hey, thanks for the follow. Whoops.
No! <laughs> no, shoot her, stupid! <laughs> God. Didn't I just save? <laughs> I feel like I should not. That's true. That is what sleep is for. Ah, uh, alright. <laughs> well, you're not supposed to get shot by a, a bazooka point blank. Forgive me. <laughs> All right, back to the stronghold. Where'd the other guy go? <laughs> is it like you pick one or the other? No, there he is. Damn it. Ha! Do you know this is a real 3DS? <laughs> Bet you didn't. Now you do. Dot, don't be shot. What does that mean? Oh, by the thing? Yeah. I'll try. I don't remember this sequence at all. I remember the last boss, so I know I beat this game. And I even remember the post game. But this part, I completely memory hold. do here. Alright, we're good. <laughs> Finally. Oh, this song is good, I remember. I think. Nope, this is the same one. I see. I'm looking for the geomagnetic pole. <laughs> well, I found it. <laughs> there we go. You want to use this because it opens up a like fast transit to the uh, labyrinth itself. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Yeah, yo, Midian. I'm four. Thank you, Sepasai. 
Mm. No, most unwise. Whoops. Yeah, I liked Portal. I like pepperoni. Oh, shit. Oh, we already went over this. I could have made this and I decided not to. Dude, I forgot about pole stones completely. I haven't used a single one this entire playthrough. <laughs> uh, labyrinth. There. Are they only 100 N in the old games too? I thought there were more. Oh, whoops. This is all wrong. Uh, what is this thing called? Purple, I have no idea. I assume strike guard's fine. Uh, leg snipe, very important. Nice. You've always been a hundo, okay. Yeah, these things are annoying. I remember them now. Uh, I assume it's going to go invisible immediately, but it's worth a try. Aha, nice. Sick. Hey, Chompy. That's rough. Uh, nice. Wow, that thing is screwed. All right, I think it's dead.
There. <laughs> uh, yep. Whatever. Holy shit. Mad Sheltered is a god tier emote. No questions asked. Or no question about it, I mean. Okay, so this is just a wall. Oh, whoops. No, that's right, that's right. Alright, this is like a dead robot or something, right? Yeah. Uh, the name? Mad Sheltered? Uh, friend of ours said that if you think a week of Garfield is funny, then you're Mad Sheltered. And it was just such a funny, like, sounding sequence of words that my friend named that emote after that. I think that's right, isn't it? Whoa, whoa, wrong way. There we go. All right. Oh, Milton, no. Oh. oh. Surely one of these is going to be locked eventually. All right, something like this, and then that was... That looks like four. We have Garfield privilege, that's true. Nice. Nice. Oh, I'm glad this team is like less uh, TP hungry than it was. Oh my God, it lived. Okay, it won't live this time. There we go. Damn, that was a big hit. Yeah.
I assume the door just resets their aggro, right? Yeah. That's bad. That looks like a time-consuming encounter. Oh shit, is that what that is? I'll be damned. That's a new emote, isn't it? Wow, he couldn't do that even with the binds on it? Or did it miss the head? No, it got the head. That's fucked up. Yeah, me too, Asteroid. Ah, uh, it's gonna blind. Oh, that's fine. This is some like Scooby Doo shit. Whew. Nice. And what have we got over here? Nice. Voxander, are you still up? Are you still watching? I think she, like, just went to do food or something. She probably even said, and I missed it. Nice. Oh, wow. <laughs> Did you make food? It's pretty damn late, so... Hey, Karagi, thank you for the raid. How are you? What were you up to? Hey, guys, I'm playing Etrian Odyssey. Uh, if you don't know it... Uh, wow, that is totally in the wrong place. Yeah, there we go. Hey, 
hey, hey, what what were you up to? How was your stream? If you guys don't know this game, uh, it is a first-person dungeon crawler. Um, where you have to draw your own map, which is what I love about it. Oh, hell yeah. How far are you? I tried to replay that recently. Uh, and I got <laughs> lost for so long in one of the temples that I was like embarrassed. I'm like, I don't think I can play this anymore. <laughs> Shouldn't have admitted that, but I did. <laughs> All right, there we go. Hey, thank you, Neo Zero. Enjoy your emotes, Rocky. You became big. Okay, yeah, I know where you are. It's a cool game. I just, uh... <laughs> I didn't really intend to drop it. I was just like, well, I'll come back to this eventually. And that ended up never happening. Yeah, yeah, Eleanor do that. So anyway, this is on a, a real 3DS. Uh, not that I have anything against emulators. I just happen to have a stream modded 3DS. Whoa. I don't. <laughs> I know some people prefer that. Yeah, yeah, have a good night. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. Hey, Calavera, how are you? So, the story here, I'm going to be real, I haven't been paying a ton of attention to it, but the, uh, this is, like, extremely vaguely based on, uh, what if I just stop it there? It's extremely vaguely based, it's extremely vaguely based on Norse mythology, so, uh, this is in the area, or the area of the world, like, around the world tree, the Yggdrasil. Yggdrasil, I don't know how you pronounce it. Uh, but there's something wrong with the world tree. And it's caused people to, like, become cursed. Uh, damn, I wonder if I can find that before it runs. Uh, whoa, shit. I get a little quiet during the combat, just to let you know, because uh, it does take a little focus. This isn't, like, a super hard video game, but you can lose very abruptly if you're not paying a ton of attention. Nice. Yeah, I agree. Uh, so anyway, the, there's something wrong with the world tree, and it's uh, unleashed, like, a plague on the world. Um, so the presumably antagonist is attempting to end that plague, but it's going to involve, like, sacrificing, you know, millions of people. Um, so that's what that little interaction was about. Nice. It could be billions, actually. All right, we're good. We're good. Whoops. Ah! All right, good. Damn, that was like 27,000 experience. Uh, all right. This looks like just one of these. So I assume there's a... Oh, no, I'm stupid. <laughs> I 
I'm hallucinating, that's what I meant. Okay, well that was... <laughs> I don't know what that was about. Presumably it's just like a flavor event, but just in case. Whoops. Oh, anyway, I was saying, this is a real 3DS. Uh, because I find this is a really uncomfortable game to play on emulators. Because uh, uh, drawing a mouse, or drawing a map of the mouse is like fine until you end up playing for six hours and 10 minutes. <laughs> and then it starts to get uncomfortable, you know, one hour into that. Yeah, I'm with you. I, It's great that they're re-releasing the uh, really old ones, especially because those are really rare now, but... Uh, pretty, pretty good. How goes uh, your, your day? <laughs> I didn't really think that through. How are you doing is what I mean. All right. This looks like a pit, right? Yeah. Finally, like an easy encounter. Uh, toasting the French. Whoa. What happened there? <laughs> Why did the tank instantly die? <laughs> I didn't catch what occurred. <laughs> Yeah, this is an easy encounter, obviously. Uh, this is a, probably a stupid idea, bringing the tank back at all. Because it's just going to kill her as soon as she reses, but you never know. Uh, no, I think uh, the rat did something. And it like hit just a billion times. Alright, cool. Oh, I'm excited for those re-releases, although I don't need them. <laughs> I have them, but I want to play... Or the games, I mean, but I want to play them. All right. Uh, if you were a robot, would you be weak to... Lightning? Nice. Yeah, I kind of want the physical release, too, I think. Yeah, that's true, actually. I, I think you're onto something. All right, they're weak to lightning. <laughs> nice. Uh, okay, so they're weak to fire. They didn't feel very weak to fire. Oh, yes, they did. That's what I meant. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, I needed that heavy iron ball item. Hmm. I might be in huge danger. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> oh. 
Emily. <laughs> I didn't mean to laugh at that, Emily. I'm sorry. That's a that's a bad thing. Oh, that was that really strong sword, wasn't it? No. <laughs> what did I need heavy iron ball for that was like actually good? It might have been some armor. It would make sense. Yeah, it wasn't one of the bows. I don't know, man. Beats me. <laughs> hey, thank you, step aside. Dude, I need to stretch, actually. That's not a bad idea. Oh my god. Oh my god, this game is so good, dude. I can't stop playing it. Oh, wow. Defense to headbind would be really nice, actually. Where's the beef? Oh, shit. Vox. I keep forgetting. Oh, my God. Whoops. <laughs> Did you answer my question? We're going to... You're not going to come over here to eat, right? Because it's, like, all late. Is that correct? I think I got sidetracked by... I, don't know, I got raided. I have no attention span anyway, so... You answered a few times. Sounds like you did not answer in the affirmative or you would have been like, Dot, when the fuck are we eating? Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. This song is so good. I would plant a big old kiss on this song's mouth. If that wasn't like a weird thing to do or say. Yeah, yeah, right on. <laughs> Deprived gamer. <laughs> oh, I didn't buy a uh, replacement thread. It's good. Uh, the shopkeepers, she has like the most charming sprite in the game, probably. Hey, General Dank, how are you? Uh, morning. Yeah. Oh, the, the girl who runs the shop. Oh, whoops, I didn't turn off that dude I got. <laughs> Remember what I said about my attention span? Her, her, her. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she didn't look like a Vox kind of character to me, to be honest. Where did I wire out? It was up here, right? Or something? I really want to get to that shortcut. Uh, purple hair and blue eyes, usually a pretty good start. Although that's not like a requirement. Uh, let's see. Vanguard. Element guard for sure. Yeah, that too. Oh wow, it made Dot taunt. That's bad.
Yeah, I'll do it. Whew, close. Uh, it's treating me pretty well. I've uh, played this before um, with this exact really stupid team composition even. But it was when the game was new, which, my god, did you know that's like a decade ago? It's actually longer than that. I think this game's like 12 years old or something. There we go. Eleven, okay, yeah. That's what I meant. I should have done line heal. Whatever. I think so. I will I will stand by this. The three DS is old. Uh but even if you see I'm of the opinion that retro means a little more than like old. You're also talking about having like a, a certain outdated, like. I shouldn't say outdated, but uh, a certain design philosophy that has fallen out of favor. Yeah, that's part of it. Uh, all right, taunt. No, taunt isn't as important as uh, element guard, actually. Ha! <laughs> God! That's one way to look at it. To me, uh, I, I was, like, talking about this online because you know that uh, retro gaming podcast, Retronauts? A lot of people go by their definition, which is if it's at least 10 years old, it's retro, which is fine, right? Because it's an arbitrary definition anyway. But it it drives me nuts sometimes. Hang on. Uh, do I really not have this thing in the... Oh, there we go. Oh, it's weak to every element. All right, cool. Uh, because some games that are like 10 years old have been remade so many times that, like, it feels a little odd to call them retro because they never, like, went away, you know? There was never a point when The Last of Us wasn't, like, a current and widely discussed and celebrated video game, even though it's old as shit now. I think by the retro nuts definition, it's a retro game. I was talking about this, and they, like, name-searched me and got defensive. <laughs> And then I was like, what, what are you talking about? And I think they like read what I was saying more closely and went, oh, never mind, sorry. <laughs> but anyway. Uh, I would say at this point, something is retro if like it was not developed with like the goal of selling DLC down the line, for example. And if it, it never lived in the shadow of microtransactions, which most games do these days. Uh, well, <laughs> you can have name search or vibes, but if you're just known to name search constantly, then the vibes aren't that important. That's all I'll say. <laughs> oh, dude, I needed both of those. The Last of Us is 10 years old. Yeah, it might be older. It might be younger. I don't know. I don't fucking know anything, dude. <laughs> you're asking the wrong person. I haven't played anything newer than, like, 1993, except Etrian Odyssey and Elden Ring, so. But I'm pretty sure it is. Ten years in June, yeah, so close. Well, he's not gonna name search Twitch. You can't do that. Yeah, Bloodborne soon. But anyway, it, the point is... <laughs> Like, while this is a stupid conversation, 
You know, no offense to you, I'm saying for me, <laughs> I'm the one leading the conversation, so it's my fault. While this is a stupid conversation, like, there is, like, something to be said for, like, well, this word that we use all the time should mean something. Like, Bloody Mary, yeah, okay. I think Oblivion is retro as shit, personally. That was, like, the horse DLC game, wasn't it? Is that what made you think of it? Because I brought up DLC. That's the medic. Yeah, I mean, I think that the fact that, like, if a, a game is a hit now, we don't let it go away. We just hold on to it forever and milk money out of it for like years to the point where everyone gets sick of it. Like look at Skyrim, right? Like that matters to me. Will Skyrim ever be retro? I don't think so because you'll never, <laughs> there'll never be a point where like Skyrim isn't just immediately readily available and like wildly popular and talked about constantly. Yeah, Todd will see to it. Yeah, that one's tricky. I I feel like it's not, but also like the Souls games have so much in common with like the develop or the game design philosophy of, you know, frankly, no. games like this. Hey, thanks for the follow. That uh You can make a case for it. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Anyway, whether you call that retro or whether you call it something else, like, it doesn't matter to me, right? But when people say retro game, they are, like, generally talking about something more specific than games released 10 years ago. That happened. <laughs> hey, TK, thank you. How are you? Uh, that was not a very productive round. <laughs> At all. Uh, shit. I'm just gonna have Dot self-heal. Uh, I know what's wrong with you. You've got, like, a life. <laughs> like, not to, that's not to say that you don't have a life if you're playing video games. It's just, like, it's harder to keep up with stuff you want to keep up with, you know? Oh my god. This one sucks. <laughs> okay, there we go. This is horrible. <laughs> this is really dangerous. Uh, so the golden one just does a little bit of extra damage, which isn't a big deal. The fact that it's paired with two back row monsters. Wow, it just forced my tank to taunt. I'm so owned. Yeah, those guys are the problem, the Medusa trees. You really want to bind their arms, but if you see these things, you really want to bind their legs. Oh, sorry, these uh, shiny monsters. No, the petrifying ones are the... Um, the scorpions, but these things uh, arm bind, and they do it to an entire line. Yeah, I think those aren't like my kinds of game. I've always wondered, like, if I like, I should try those, like. 
I, are those Bethesda? I genuinely don't know. Those like Bethesda open world games, just to see what they're like. I've had that thought before, Emily. Oh, another Yggdrasil trunk. These are just all over the place. I see. I don't keep up with these things. I'm I'm genuinely like a little out of touch when it comes to new video games. Oh, the very fact that I called New Vegas a new video game says says that, right? Okay, good. Out of the way. Um, I didn't realize those games are all like first person shooters. Okay, um, this is a really weak encounter, honestly. Is it ugly? <laughs> yeah, you, that's just how I am. I want to play the games with the quality of life removal patches. <laughs> I don't really know anything about New Vegas. I just know it like takes place in a like post-apocalyptic like uh, Vegas and I think that would be so depressing that I wouldn't be able to like enjoy the game like when uh, uh yeah see I didn't even know that apparently wait no Vegas is in Nevada right I'm stupid <laughs> uh I, okay, if, if you're saying that it's the fact that it plays like that, that sucks, I I sort of suspect that would be my response to it, too. Uh, whoops. Because when I heard that those games were, like, first-person shooters, like, gameplay-wise, I was disappointed. Uh, if you're not, then, uh, you know... Sometimes I put words in people's mouth and you have to live with that. But I'm genuinely interested. Like, I genuinely want to try those games, even though I kind of feel like I know how it's going to end. Uh, just because I don't feel like there's... What the fuck is going on here? Oh, that's right. I don't feel like you gain a lot by, like, just remaining really close-minded about you know, the things you enjoy in my, in my case, video games. Oh, a curse hammer, huh? Uh, is arena older than doom? I forget. That's actually huge progress. So, don't make fun of this for me, guys. Or you can, I don't give a shit. Make fun of, of me if you must. But the map design in this is like Dark Souls in that uh, there are all these like shortcuts. Uh, and so finding these is like huge for making progress in the dungeon. Because on my return trip, I'm not going to have to deal with anything in the northwest corner of this map to get back to where I was. It really is like Souls, though. Because that's like the defining thing about Dark Souls level design to me is that the, the shortcuts work really well because, you know, the level design is so, like, thorough 
and like lived in and realistic, you know? Like the places aren't designed like video game levels. They're designed like, okay, if you had a castle, you know, <laughs> I got to get a uh, water. Did you? <laughs> uh, I don't think auto taunt went off, right? I really love these cats, the way they just kind of like bat their arms around. This is like such a good sprite. When do they introduce pugilists? Is that um five? It's Pew Gillist, isn't it? Yeah, have a good night, Eltriok. I really should be going to bed, too. It's 1.30 in the morning where I am. Wah! Wow, that was close. No, this song is from Etrian Odyssey 3. This is Etrian Odyssey 4. Or no. It's it's one of the boss songs. It's from Etrian Odyssey 3. Never mind. This is 4. There we go. Yeah, I can't stop on haunting. Did I bring her hammer? I'll be damned, I did. Oh yeah, that was in the dungeon. A new bow. Oh, whoops. There, bow. Oh, it sucks. <laughs> well, that's nice. <laughs> hey, Memory Lane, thank you for the raid. How are you? I'm still playing Etrian Odyssey. I've been at this all night. <laughs> oh, weird. Where did I get the mystery shard? Hey there, Tecolote, thank you. Hey, thanks for the shout out mods. What were you doing, Memory Lane? Yeah, handily. Uh, damn. 289 defense does sound pretty nice. I feel like I should pull the trigger on that, maybe. Like, maybe not right now, but. Haha. <laughs> Nice. What were you what were you playing? Oh, sick. What category? I I really like that game as a speed game. I um Oh, whoops. Uh labyrinth. There we go. Uh So Etrian Odyssey 1 uh, from what I've been told, because I haven't played it, but I know a lot of people who have, is so hostile as to be frustrating. So if you don't like games that are, like, really mean, 
11 uh, 11 exits glitchless. So that means what? Not doing that like orb thing or the uh, there's like a what's the other one? Isn't there like another glitch on uh, what's it? Bowser. Hey, thank you, Memory Lane. Uh, I think you want to head snipe these, right? This actually seems like a really annoying encounter just because when am I going to hit them? You're going to be invisible the whole time. I could just hit them right away, I guess. Yeah, no orb, no cloud. I thought it was the cloud, but then I got my confidence waned for some reason. Uh, t -t 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 -t. Oh, wait, uh, what are these? They're weak to ice. Oh, no, they resist ice. Okay. Uh, fuck it. I'm just gonna keep attacking and hope it works. I don't know why I'm bothering to target this manually. It's gonna die right away. Yeah, I could see that. I want to play all of these, but I could understand uh, not feeling that pressure. Okay, yeah, blindness doesn't persist after battle. I was just watching um, the You Can Beat video games about Super Mario World. There are so many, like, interesting glitches in there that I'd never heard of. I'm sure if you're, like, a Super Mario World person. They're like old news. I had no idea about the weird invisible Yoshi thing. Okay, good, good, good. Oh, hang on. Oh, there's a damn uh, deal back there, huh? <laughs> hey, thanks for the follow. Thank you. I kind of hate this encounter now. I'm not sure like what parts. Oh wait, uh, you arm snipe. That uh, go berserk attack that the rats do is. That one, yeah. Like, <laughs> like that's nuts, right? That it did that. Hey, thanks, Memory Lane. Enjoy your emote, Saplex. So that was. Uh, Luck was involved in that. Uh, that attack... Um, 
picks targets at random. So it's partly luck, partly um, she has a really high uh, level taunt skill. And I think auto taunt did go off at the beginning of that fight. So if it checks, if it like rolls a taunt check every single time it assigns one of those attacks, then it kind of makes sense to me that it just completely killed the tank. That's not the first time that's happened. Oh, good. Nice. What's a six? Ta 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 ta. Shit. <laughs> uh, this is really, really dangerous. <laughs> Hey, thanks for the follow. Yeah, thank you. I love this game. Uh, hang on. It's really important to bind these things arms. Even though I want to leg bind it so that it doesn't run away. Uh, I know, this sucks. There's like not a good choice to make here. Please just run. Damn it. All right. Damn, look at that. How many of them have leg binds? Just one. I hate using my turn this way, but I really don't want it escaping. All right, cool. Pretty close. Uh, I'll just hit this thing, whatever. Nah, there's no point in leg sniping here. I don't know about flank shot. I feel like this isn't high enough level. Whoa. Why did you ask that? <laughs> How did you know? I'm actually working on, you know, Tengai Makio Jiraiya, right? The first one? I'm working on a fan translation of that. Um, and it hasn't been going like super quick, but uh, I got in touch with a really, like a really helpful and talented hacker. So what I have, which is about three hours of the game, uh, is playable. It hasn't been released just cause, you know, it hasn't gone through an editing pass or anything. No shit, that's a weird coincidence. Yeah, I, um, so I have, uh, seven, yeah, seven years of experience working in the, uh, manga, uh, business as a translator. Um, so that's my, my pedigree. That's why I am working on that translation, but I had to pick up a day job also in the manga industry. 
um, because my rent just doubled, which has slowed down my progress on that project greatly. Uh, but yeah, th that game's great. Did you read the thing in my uh, bio about PC Engine? Is that why you brought that up? Or was this just like the most improbable read of all time? Okay, how do I represent numbers? Uh, that works. The other one was a language I couldn't read. Oh, hang on. Yeah, okay. <laughs> uh, taunt. I legitimately cannot tell which bind I need to apply to keep it from doing that uh, taunt thing, whatever this works. Nice. Okay, yeah, it's head. Uh, did I put a circle down? Completed a translation? Really, I haven't heard anything about that. There was, uh... The... Uh, I can't say. <laughs> I know stuff about other uh, fan translations. But I shouldn't uh, talk about it. Uh, after... After... Uh, Jiraiya, honestly. Uh, I want to work on Monty Maru personally. Because that game is also really, really cool. Okay. Do, do Icon Blue to the uh, guard bots now? Yeah, that's what that is. That, like, uh, pacing behavior. I'm just going to assume this is also the case. Oh, that may not be, actually. No, it is. All right. Yeah, Manji Maru is a classic, though. Like, that game is so cool. Uh, yeah. So, shit. <laughs> uh... Oh! Get out of there. Oh, I think auto canceled the burst. I hate how the auto battle works. Right. I, yeah, I wasn't asking. I was, I was saying, oh, I con blue to them now. I'm surprised because I was uh, conning yellow before. All right, there we go. Yeah, that's pretty big progress, honestly. I got those other two-way walls. I feel like I have to call it here, right? Well, I, the problem is that I already assigned some actions, and then I hit auto battle, and I keep doing this. If you do that, it unassigns those actions, which is bad. Yeah, 2 a.m. <laughs> that's, the, that's the thing. Oh man, this game is dangerous, dude. I've been playing so long. Whoops.
Yeah, it was a seven hour stream, I guess, huh? Oh man. I love this game. I'm really strong now. It's not impossible that I could beat it next stream, but it's this end game is sort of long. Uh, I don't want to say what happens because it's like story spoilers. It might take two streams. I've been enjoying on Thursdays doing uh, this. I think making this a dedicated like RPG and dungeon crawler and shit day might work. Uh, I'll tell you what. I saved, right? I hope I did, because the... <laughs> Have I ever retired any of my party? No. Why would you do mini dot? Right when I'm right when I'm cutting stream. So uh that was fun. Thanks for thanks for watching. Ugh. Um I am probably not streaming tomorrow. I'm I make a habit of taking Fridays off. Yeah, I remember it. It's just with the digital download copy, like the saving is so fast that it's easy to miss. Uh, anyway, I hope you had fun watching. Hey, thank you, Sarzak. So if I beat Etrian Odyssey next stream and I decide I want to keep using Thursday as like an RPG slot, what I might do is uh, move on to... I'm considering doing Dragon Quest and then Dragon Quest 2. And then I might need to take a break between Dragon Quest 2 and 3. Dragon Quest 1 is a short game. Uh, if you like know vaguely what to do anyway. Um, it could be a single sitting uh, game, although honestly... Uh, Probably not, because it's like six or seven hours, uh, even if you're following a speedrun route. Obviously not that like manipulated speedrun route where there's no luck, uh, but I recently I, I've developed this thing where I, I'm like kind of obsessed, I think, with uh, Dragon Quest 1 through three yeah the nes versions of course that's how i am i think uh some remakes of those games look really cool and really interesting i hear that the super famicom uh remake of one has like crashing issues though uh it's specifically the fan translation makes it crash a bunch what's going on uh I have too many options, as happens sometimes. Without any rebalance hacks. <laughs> have you ever known me to use a rebalance hack? You know who I gotta raid. Uh, Stealthy Golem, who is very cool and very has a very like interesting stream is playing Kingsfield 3 which if you like Atrian Odyssey <laughs> you probably already know the Kingsfield games and you probably kind of like them uh, so I'm going to watch that a little bit I also have to figure out food but that's my problem <laughs> not, not yours <laughs> oh my god so yeah, thanks so much for watching. Um, I probably won't be back tomorrow. I'll probably be back on Monday, but you never know. Uh, I got some stuff I want to play. Uh, so we'll see. Now then, go say hi to Stealthy Golem. I'll be there too. Uh, and I'll see you uh, next stream. <laughs> Whenever that is. Have a good night, everybody.